stinky. Stinky, stinky, stinky. Go down! Ah, he's here! Yes! Oh, he's here! Yes! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> my people. Welcome back. Welcome back. I hope you guys had a fantastic weekend. Jeez, here we are again. Oh, man. I Again, I'm so excited for tonight's stream. This could be a blast. You may notice that I'm wearing the same headphones that I wore on Saturday when I said they are absolutely broken and falling off my head. Look. Look right here. Mind the gap. How do I do this? Mind the gap. Look at this. <laughs> look how far off my head they are. I got new headphones, but they literally, the Amazon guy came 30 minutes ago. And so they're not charged, and also I'm really scared to just, like, go into it without testing them at all, like, to stream it and everything. I'm sure it's gonna, like, mess up my default microphone and default, you know, headphones and everything. Plus, I was kind of preparing for the stream up until, like, 7.28, so, uh, we're, we're going with the old boys. One last ride. One last ride on these, uh, on these puppies, so... What is up, guys? I hope that you had a fantastic weekend. I hope you're ready for some fun time tonight. Let me say hi to some people. Now, I'm going to ask if you've never been said hi to before. If I've never said your name, if I've never caught you in the mass of people, then you can say hi. Otherwise, maybe hold off. Maybe let some other people catch up. But then I, I, I'm going to try to get my like do my best to, to hit as many people as I can. But again, <laughs> Blade says I shut up now. Uh, hello to KM and TLR. Hello to you. Hello to Polecat3. What is up? M. M is saying stuff right now. M, you better watch yourself. I say hi to you all the time. Hello to Damn Love and Rain Bell and Charlotte Williams and Jace and Demon Friend. Look at all these people. I've never hit any of you guys. I suck, man. I really do. <coughs> Oh my god. Hello to Demon Friend. Hello to Elf. What is up, Brianna and Sarah and Lara and Nathan Tate? What is up? Welcome. Welcome. Uh, there is also uh, Stairfell and Tracy and help. I'm stuck in the void. Sorry about that, but hello to you. Subject S. What is up? Caitlin. Hello to you. Haley MCC. Hello to Polecat3 and Sam M and Roger and Alex and Maya Sim. Maya? You tricked me. You tricked me, Maya. Willow. Hello to you. Hello, Katie. Hello, Melissa and Maggie and Afraid of Space. Welcome to all you guys. Seriously. Snow Steel. Hello, Bobble and uh, Ghoulish, Megan Patterson, Moth, and I'm probably missing a bunch of people. Will PK, don't talk to me. Minty Pixel, okay, and, uh, a bunch of other people. Now people are saying it twice. See, now this is the problem. Now I'm reading the same names twice. Mandy Ree and Sophia and Alex and, uh, and again. All right, now I'm reading too many names twice. All right, I'm sorry. I hope I hit a bunch of people I don't normally hit. Don't unsurp noob me. All right, don't unsurp noob me for that Alaroda. Guys, welcome. Uh, let me tell you guys what we're doing tonight, because we've got... A, uh, a good stream for you guys. Probably going to be in the realm of maybe two and a half hours, something along those lines. So it should be a lot of fun. First up, we're going to be attempting something that is a little scary. All right. I'm sure a lot of you guys know what Wordle is. Okay. Wordle, for, if you don't know, it's like a word puzzle game. And it's basically every day there is a five letter word. Well, I don't know. I have to explain this in great detail now. I'm probably going to explain it again. I'll, I'll explain it when we like actually get into it. But it's a, it's a word puzzle game, right? And it's normally you trying to guess a five letter word. But today I found a website that lets you go any number of letters that you want in the word. And so we're going to go all the way up to 11. 11 letters over twice the length of a normal wordle and we're gonna see if we can't crack the clue it might be hard to even think of letters or words that are 11 letters long but we're gonna do our absolute best um apparently it's not actually as hard as you might think because there's like you can add like lee and like plural to a lot of stuff but we're, we're gonna try we're gonna absolutely try so the 11 letter wordle is first up on our to-do list after that I promised you guys on Saturday some Stardew Valley TikToks and I did not deliver because we went over and so we're going to react to some Stardew Valley TikToks again for the fourth time now. Yeah, that's right. I'm still milking that. Absolutely. I'm going to milk that. Are you kidding me? Those videos outperformed the trials. You think I'm going to stop reacting to Stardew TikToks at this point? Absolutely not. And our last thing, the main event of the night comes in at nine o'clock Eastern and just under an hour and a half. I'm joined by Matt McCluskey, Therm, Ring Queen, and Charlie Barley as we are entering into PowerPoint night. Oh my goodness, do I love PowerPoint night. I have done this three times in the past, twice before I even had any sort of sizable audience. And uh, the one other time was a lot of fun as well. So PowerPoint night is I've asked all of my friends to come up with a short three to four minute PowerPoint presentation on something that they think it's important that more people know about. All right. I say that very seriously. It's not a serious thing. It's a lot of fun and it's normally very funny. I'm going to try to convince everyone to get dressed up for it. Then also I'll probably just throw on like a, a, 
a not a blazer, yeah, a blazer and uh, and a tie or something like that. But yeah, it's gonna be fun. I freaking love PowerPoint night, and we got some funny people doing it with us. So gonna be great. This time I am not complaining about time zones. Uh, this time I'm simply sharing the good news of. Uh, something that you'll find out about at nine o'clock. I'm not making my PowerPoint live this time. It's the first time I've ever made my PowerPoint ahead of time, but I wanted you guys to be surprised by it as well. So uh, yeah, should be really good. What are we saying? What do we say right now? M said, hello, CA, anything for you and a credit card? Oh my God, what? What, is, what are we talking about? I don't know. Um, but yeah, it should be a lot of fun. Dude. I, I freaking love PowerPoint night. going to be a blast. Hey, speaking of Wordle, before we get into it, Em was talking about it here in the uh, in the pre-stream chat. But yeah, I saw on Twitter today, Wordle was bought by the New York Times, which I absolutely... Em is laughing now, I don't know. Um, Wordle was bought by the New York Times, which for the guy that made it, I think his name's like Noah or something like that. Maybe I'm entirely wrong. He sold it for like millions and millions of dollars. Absolutely best decision. Seriously. It's like you made a freaking hit game. And if you can sell that thing before it loses its hype and while it still has a ton of value, like, yeah, do that. Do that for sure. So, uh, yeah, that, that's just absolutely worth doing. So, uh, yeah, absolutely get his bag for sure. I think that the New York Times, as well as a lot of other people think this too, are going to ruin it, honestly. Um, probably oh, lethal out of Syria and wants my money, CA. So yeah. Um, yeah, I think that, um, I think the New York Times is probably going to ruin it and put it behind a paywall and it's going to suck and that Wordle is dead. Wordle is dead after this pretty soon, but I mean, for the time being, it's, it's still alive and also the guy made his bag off of it. So that is a, a definitely a smart move. And there's other websites too. Actually, this website that I'm doing today, if you guys ever just have the hankering for some Wordle, will let you do like an unlimited number per day which I will admit does like take some of the fun away from it because it's like, oh, come on. There's like that common thing where it's like, oh, did you get today's word? It's like one a day and being able to share that with your friends. Like there is something special about that. But anyway, uh, yeah, that's that's just today in the news. Also, things that happened today. I got my uh, COVID booster shot and nothing of interest happened. Absolutely not. I've been putting it off for months and it literally from the time I scheduled it to the time I was back home, Took me 30 minutes. So, again, I don't know. I just didn't do it for a really, really long time. I meant to do it, like, over November, like, over Thanksgiving break, and just forgot. So, anyway, got that. Maybe I'll die. Maybe I'll be super duper sick and not be able to stream on Thursday. But, honestly, I was good the first time around. Like, it didn't affect me at all, except for my arm was sore. And even now, that's not the case. Like, I'm, I'm feeling good. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm chilling. So, anyway, maybe I will live to regret those sentences that I just spake into existence. But, hey, I gotta, gotta milk some content out of it, you know? At least now I have a clip of me saying, oh, I'm feeling fine. And then I can turn into a TikTok or something. I don't know. Uh, hey, we also, I want to say something else that's coming up pretty soon. I don't know if either of my parents are in the chat right now. But if you guys remember, not like this last weekend, but the weekend before that, my parents came to visit me and I had them film some animations and Lerpa's animation is getting posted on Wednesday. That is absolutely right. Lerpa, my mom, my own mother, I filmed her in front of a green screen being ridiculous, filmed a little Stardy Valley skit and it's getting posted on Wednesday. I think it's funny. It's, it's really, uh, it's a good one and it's really fun to see. Alchemy is sending like little pictures. It's not done yet, but she sends like the... The individual frames to see like what people look like and uh, it's gonna be great. Oh nice, Lerpa says yes both of us are here. So Lerpa's animation is on Wednesday and then the next week is actually Matt McCluskey. I did one with him and then the week after that will be my dad. So yeah, get hyped for that. Make sure that you tell Lerpa she freaking killed it a after you watch it of course. Don't just be you know boosting her ego for no reason but um, yeah anyway. Uh, so cool, there's that and then uh, what else is also on the sketch? Oh, I wanted, I, I asked Em what she thought I should talk about, and she said, you should bring up your race to 100k with Therm, because you haven't done that for a while. Uh-oh, I haven't for a while. I actually do want to bring this up, because I keep forgetting to bring it up in the intro of my videos. Like, that's when I'm intending on doing it, and then I just keep on forgetting. But I want to show you guys, how we have, we've pretty much closed the gap on Therm now. It's a friendly little competition between myself and Therm, if you don't know, we're racing to 100,000 subscribers. And we are both in like the mid 80K range right now. And so I actually want to show you guys specifically, here is the live update. This is brought to us by someone on Twitter by the name of Brittany Lewis. Has this live stream going up. It's been streaming, she's been streaming since January 21st, 2022. 
And she just did this. There's uh, one person watching now, it's me. But there is a, a live stream link at all times that keeps track of my subscribers, Therm subscribers, and Wallagugs. And so when we started, I think we were at we were at 51K and Therm was at like 73K or something like that. And then I had a really big January and now I am within 1,000 of Therm. Well, actually he's like a little over 1,000 now. So we're, we're pretty much 1,000 away from each other. It's kind of goes back and forth. Oh, I'm blocking it. Oops. It kind of goes back and forth between, um, it goes back and forth between like 900 off and 1,000 off, something like that, or 1,100 off. Uh, so we're right around there. And Wallagog is also here just for funsies. So. Um, yeah, this is this is pretty crazy that it's it's this close now, and we were both in the home stretch. Honestly, I didn't think there was any chance that I would beat him, and so I'm kind of uh, excited that it's going to be as close as it is. So anyway, there's that. Kind of cool. Just wanted to update you guys that that is still going on, and remember, the loser is going to have to eat a piece of paper with a picture of the winner's face on it. So support your boy. I mean, all of you guys are probably subscribed because you're here, but... I don't know, just want <laughs> Wallaco coming in with the win from behind. Who would, who would ever guess? Definitely could have happened. He was really close to me, too. <laughs> Leaps his P right back and make 15,000 YouTube channels. Oh, that's funny. Um, yeah, all right. That's pretty much all I really wanted to talk about. Besides, I did over the weekend convince somehow. I convinced Ring Queen to play Rocket League. Oh my god, dude. I mean, you know how she is, and you know how she's always nervous in every situation. And now you put her in, like, a high-intensity game where, like, her decisions matter. And she's also a yeller. She she just yells at all times. And uh, it's very, very funny to watch her go, like, flying in for a ball that's, like, right in front of their net. And she's, like, she goes charging full speed ahead, about five times the speed that she can handle, screaming, like, ah! and just driving right under the ball and just right into their net and then ending up upside down. Dude, it is an experience. It really is. I will say her very first goal ever. I was I was playing her very first game I played with her, right? And we're playing doubles, casual doubles. And that I score a couple, they score a couple, go back and forth. I don't think she scored at all the first couple games we played. But then, then she's playing, right? And she gets a touch on the ball. It is not in the direction of the net, of the opposing team's net in any way. She touches the ball. Then the other team hits it to like the total opposite side of the field, right? And then they both chase after it. Both people on the other team chase after it. And they come from opposite directions and they pinch the ball right. Like they get it on either side and they pinch the ball like Mach 10 into their own net. The, the other team own goals in a moment of panic, all right? And because Rin was technically the last person to touch the ball, she got credit for the goal. And it was also like an absurdly fast goal. Like if you pinch the ball like that, that's the fastest way to score a goal in Rocket League by a long shot. And so not only was the Rin score her very first goal that game, it was 166 kilometers an hour. If you're wondering, basically like the fastest you can get it without pinching it is like 130. Most goals are in the like 90 to 110 range if they're a normal shot, right? At a low level, they're normally in like the 40 to 50 range, right? So for her to get a 166 kilometer per hour pinch was is ridiculous. Like that is unbelievably calculated. And uh, it was very fun to watch her like just cheer and scream out of excitement that she scored a goal, even though it had been a good 10, 15 seconds since she had touched the ball. <laughs> oh man. So that was, that was a whole experience, but all right. Anyway, hey, let's get into it. Let's get our high YouTubes ready because I want to attempt this 11 letter wordle. I'm a little scared. I'm, uh, I'm a little frightened, I do admit, but it's going to be fun. So get your high YouTubes ready. I will drink my water. Oh, is Rin here? There she is. Rin, you weren't supposed to hear any of that. I, I roasted her too much for her to be here. All right, here we go. <clears throat> my people, unless you've been living under a rock, you have played the popular word game Wordle. It's a daily puzzle game where every day you have to try to guess a five letter word. Well, I found a website that lets us do it all the way up to 11 letters. I don't know if this is possible. I don't even know if I know any 11 letter words, honestly, but I'm going to see if myself and my chat can figure out just one of these godforsaken puzzles. Let's get into it. That was all right. That was all right right there, right? 
Uh, Alchemy, thank you for the 100 uh, check dollars. I don't know what they're called, so I'm going to call them checkers. Thank you for the 100 checkers. I hereby redeem the flamingo tie and Winston by your side for PowerPoint night. I will do the flamingo tie portion of it. Winston may have to stay banished back there. It's been a while since Winston has been the focal point of any streams, but he's chilling. He's holding down the fort. Let's switch on over to Wordle here. I want to show, first off, how this works for the uninitiated. Let me make this as big as possible. Oh, can I not do like 175? Too small. 200? Too big. We'll do 175. All right, so this is like an off-brand website of like the official Wordle, but this is what it normally looks like. It's like a five-letter word. And so you put a five-letter word in. And it will tell you if it's gray, that means that the letter S is not anywhere within this five-letter word. If it's yellow, that means that this letter is within this five-letter word, but it's not in the fourth position. It's somewhere else. And I didn't get any, but if it's green, that means you're in the right spot. And so you have six total guesses, and I'll just give up for an example here. So the word this time was fence. So if you can guess the word fence within six guesses, you win. The, there's more clout to be had if you get it in less guesses, but honestly, I just want to get it at all because this is what we're going to be doing. Five-letter wordle? Six? Seven, eight, 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 it's 11, it's 11. There's no need for a dramatic buildup. We're doing an 11 letter wordle. Look at the girth of this grid right now. A six by 11 grid, here's normal wordle, girthy girdle. That's not what I wanted to say. Um, so here, what we're gonna do is we're going to work together by coming up with some good words. I already see a good one in the chat. Information is 11 letters, I love it. So I'm gonna type it in, information. Ooh, okay. I have no idea if that's good or not. So the R is in the right spot, and the yellows are all words that are... are the, uh, yeah, so the, the R is in the right spot, and all of the yellows... Like, there's an I, there's an N, there's an F, there's a T, there's an A somewhere. Hmm. And the reason that this I is yellow and this I is gray is because there's w only one I, if that makes sense. So yeah, we'll have to try to think, like... That I think a lot of these words will probably have like a suffix, right? Don't you think like it would end in like li or t or shun or s <laughs> I don't know. Like I think I think uh, that could be the case. So I, it's not an ing word because this i is is gray. If it was if it was correct, this one would be green. And there's no n, so it's not an ing. I kind of want to get a word that has like li in it. What about like? Furiously. Nope, I'm short. How about, um, pristinely? Nope, all right, again, all right. God, this is bad. I, I want an L-Y word. Don't say vicariously. You got that from the thumbnail, all right? The thumbnail of the stream says vicariously. Exposed. Caught. I guess it could be an ED word also. Maybe we should try that. I, I kind of like the idea of copyrighted. So C-O... All right, so again, normally in real Wordle, if you know that there isn't an O, like you're probably, you shouldn't do that again, but like it's 11 letters long. Maybe we can have a couple repeats. Let's try copy righted. Well, that's really good. That's a really good guess. Let's try. That is huge. That is absolutely huge to have three green letters already. All right, I'm loving this. So it's not an ED word because the E is in the wrong position. But that's that's pretty good, man. That, that's pretty good. Shout out to whoever said that. I'm sorry I didn't read your name. Again, there is more clout in the less letters you can get it in. Like the less, the, the, the less, or yeah, how do I say it? There is more clout to be had in the smaller number of guesses that you can take. So I, I kind of want to be a little picky with them now. But it begins with a C. Let's try like... Mm, nope, that's nothing. I was going to say Christmas, which is also not that many. Oh, wow. Hold on a second. Cameron in the chat. That is a huge one. Centrifugal? Is that... Hold on. I want to confirm letter by letter. C E N. T-R-I-F-U-G-A-L. I bet this is it, right? That, that is a, a huge guess. 
none of those letters are bad letters. Could we really get this in three, dude? Oh my god, how am I gonna make a video out of this if we get it in three? Go! Oh my god! Oh my god, the power of the chat is too much. Alright, so... <sighs> so that was easy, thanks for watching, guys. No, no, we're not done, we're not done. Alright, here's the deal. I was originally gonna say, can our hive mind of people just do this at all? But it's not fair, when I have, you know, hundreds of people helping me out. I think I need to attempt this solo. I think what I need to do is minimize the chat real quick. And I'm going to see if I can't help and do it myself. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go back in here. No help this time. We're going to start with my absolute favorite word. I didn't have one in mind when I said that. Uh, christening. an I towards the end, but no N G at the end. What about happenstance? Nope, that's not right. How about hmm what could that end with? Ili? Could it end with like an Ali? Right? Like if I what if I did like no, I was going to do fantastically. Um, see, happily is way too short. I need... What do I need as the base letter? I guess I need an eight-letter word as my base if I'm going to end it with Eli. Participatory? No, that's probably too long. I really, I'm just saying random words until I find one that happens to be 11 letters. Um, let's see. Let me try to find one that starts with one of these letters. Maybe like this H is, or maybe the T. Maybe it's, I see a T and an H. There's a T and an H. Maybe I try like, thank, Thanksgiving. <laughs> no, that's not. Um, Thankfully, <laughs> thankfully, thankfully, no, not a valid word. Thankfully, they didn't like it. Oh, no. Oh, see, now this is so much pressure because now it's, I have to do this in front of people. Oh, man. Um, distinctly, <laughs> that's not how you spell that, distinctly. Um, Maybe I just try disturbings. Maybe I maybe I should just try like another word and just gather some more info here before I start sweating too hard the suffix. Um passive No, that's not long enough. Um opposition. That's no, that's also not a good word. God, this is so difficult. Wrestling? No, it's not long enough, dude. Oh my god, I'm choking. Alright, I'm gonna peek real quick. I'm gonna peek at the chat real quick. Nope, no one said anything helpful. Perfect. Um... Stratosphere... Strat I'm getting words that are too far off. Alright, I'm gonna do one from the thumbnail. Vicariously. Oh, okay. Wow, so it ends with the Y, but is not Eli. It's Eni with an N at the end? There is an N in it, right? Maybe it's like Eni? Because there is an N. See, nothing is... Uh, all the words I think of are too too short. I don't even think that's how you spell that. I'm also a terrible speller, so please don't hurt me. Um, maniacally? That's not... Ah, dude, I'm probably spelling all these words wrong, too. Oh, no. I can't look at the chat. I'm looking over at my Discord right now. It's not even helpful. Maybe... Pleasability. Pleasability. 
Oh, maybe it ends in a T. A T at the end. Disability. T. Oh. How did you guys get centrifugal? You guys make me feel so stupid when you just bust out centrifugal on the third guess when we have like next to no information. What about, is this the right number? Anti-gravity. <gasps> okay, okay. We've got ourselves, we've got ourselves a little itty on our hands. We've got an itty, itty, itty. Hmm, so that takes care of my T. Okay, okay. This is where I have run out of ideas. Let's try... I've used two of the words from the thumbnail, I realized. Didn't I use christening and vicariously in the thumbnail? God, I'm terrible. Um... A T. A T. A T. I need words that end with a T. What? How many letters do I have? It's... If it ends with ability. So it's nothing ability at the end, because then the G... Like, that would have to be a G. City? Maybe it ends in city? City like that? Oh man, dude, this is this is some rough stuff right here. Oh dude, I, how am I supposed to get this? I just want another word that is 11 letters long. And it's not litty at the end, dude. I mean, I'd still need the N somewhere. It's probably not there, though. I was really proud of anti-gravity. I won't even cap. Uh, maybe I peek at chat real quick for a second. What are you guys saying? I don't even know that word. Alright, I'm gonna try, because you guys are all convinced it's this. If it's this... Dude, I... <laughs> Homogeneity? What even is that? All right, well, I was never getting that. I'm trying another one. You, you, what in the world are you guys talking about right now? How how am I to get that? I could have got centrifugal eventually. All right, okay, don't say let's go. Don't say let's go, okay? We're, we're cheering for me and my journey, okay? I'm going to go again. Oops, that's my PowerPoint. Uh, we're, we're cheering for me, okay? Let me, let me minimize this again. I'm, I'm going back. I'm, I'm doing I'm attempting it again by myself. Let's try our favorite word. Vicariously. We got our O in the right spot. Uh, let's see if we can't end maybe uh, blissfully or bliss blissfulness bliss uh, str strengthens strengthens. Ooh, that was a powerful word. Ooh, it could be an ing word because we've got our I and we've got our N here and I have we also have a G. All right, it's definitely an ing word, right? X X R X I N G something like that. Maybe it's like a ring, O ring. Or sing. I'm trying to look at our yellow letters. O ting. <laughs> I probably sound like an idiot trying to just like puzzle my way through this. Oh, there is a C. Maybe it's a CHR start. Is this anything? Cr 
chronically. Oh, chronically. Oh, gosh. I was typing that as a joke. Okay. Well, there's some more info on our third guest. Or our third guest. I thought that might be a CHR start. Okay, we've got a lot of letters, though. Again, I think it's that ING ending. Hmm. Horseradish. <laughs> okay, wait, we got some We got some more letters off of that. So let, let's recap. We got unknown, O-R-X-X-X-O-X-I-N-G. O-O-Ting? O-O-Ping? O-O-Jing? Ohing, Oting, O Owing, Ofing. Oh no, dude. I'm afraid it's gonna be some other word I don't know, and I'm gonna waste all my time trying to figure it out. Ah. Four. <gasps> no, never mind. I thought I was so smart. <laughs> oh my god. I gotta leave it up here for a second out of shame, dude. I actually thought I just cracked the clue. Okay, um. Four. No. No, no, I had such a good feeling there for a second. Oh, the A, it doesn't start with an H or a C. What other letters do we have that we haven't used that it might start with? It might be a T? Probably not an I. Let's, let's see if it's the T. Oh, wait, have we done an F yet? Fort. Fortific fortificating? That's not how you spell that. Oh no, dude. Maybe it's that T. Tor... Torsioning? Nope, that's not a word also. Tor... X O R T. Maybe that's where the T goes. Fortnite. I just keep going back to Fortnite, dude. I don't know. It's not anywhere close to the number of letters that we need either. Gorth. Gorth is nothing. Maybe maybe it's a T H though. Gorth. Oh. Fourth. <laughs> Fourth. Forthcoming. <gasps> In case anyone needed any evidence for why I have this thing right here, this little little piece of paper, in case anyone needed this backed up, there's your evidence that I deserve my diploma. Oh my god, what a rush. What a rush that was. Holy crap. Woo! Oh my god, what a what a good and and family friendly <laughs> rush that was. Man, nothing gets the blood pumping quite like a word puzzle, am I right? All right, now let's see. Does this go any lower than five? <gasps> the four-letter wordle. What if we could try to get this in two? Do you think it's possible to get this in two? Did the chat get it first? I didn't read the chat, all right? I got it eventually, too. We're going to try to speed run this. We're going to try to speed run two, and we're starting with bean. Okay, let's try fort. Okay, giving up, giving up. What was the word on that one? It was Rick. It was Rick. It was a whole person's name. Let's try Bean again. Okay, now let's try Goth. Ah, uh, why did I try Goth when I knew what the A was? Okay, try again. Um, let's try, uh, how about rags? I need something. You gotta give me something. How about toil? Oh my god, hold on. Now I gotta do this one. Chew. Okay, um... Uh, what, what, a duck? 
Oh, oh my god, okay, maybe we, maybe we move on from this one before we find out what that is. Um, <laughs> let's try... Um, don't say beans. I actually start the legitimate wordles with beans, okay? Um, let's try... Poll. I need to stop getting nothing. No information. Um, how about... I was gonna do snap, but now I don't have that. Stab. Uh, give up. What was the word? Acid. Rapid fire. Gotta keep her going. Gotta keep her going. Uh, both. Please, dude. Please. Um, mean. <gasps> Can we get in three? Maybe I gotta work with you guys. Maybe I should start using my resources. How about... What do we think? It, there's no way. It's not Bean. I got excited for a second, though. Fern? That's a decent guess. I'll try Fern. There's a lot, though. There's, there's so many words this could be. So many. I feel like 4 is almost harder than 11. Uh, it's not Deer, because there's no R now. Maybe, is it Nerd, or are you just bullying me? Nope, There's. we already used the R. That's just someone being mean to me. Neon? There's no O! There's no O! Use your eyes, people! I saw Neon suggested multiple times. My flamingo fell? Oh no, it did. Oops. All right, well, I'll fix that one then. That's not Winston, it's the it's the little one. Oh my god. He traveled so far. He fell so far. Bugs? No, why? Who is saying bugs? Nick, you're one of my mods. Don't suggest bugs in this scenario. Vain. Guys, all right, now the, go the goal has changed. We're just trying to get one, okay? Um, soup? Don't say soup. That's not a good suggestion. Are you guys like sewn? Oh my god, guys, hold on. We cannot choke this. We cannot choke this right now, please. Oh my god, this is so bad. It's not lean. We have used the A. Look at the keyboard, people. Look at the keyboard. Think before you speak. STOP SAYING BEAN! It's not kill. It's not kill. It is so not kill. Fart? You suggested fart. You suggested F-A-R-T. Four letters that are already grayed out. That is the worst guess I've seen so far. What is keen? Keen is nothing. Oh, it is- that is a word. I forgot that's not just M's last name. Oh! <gasps> The clutch. The clutch of a lifetime. Oh my god. Okay. Alright. I'm trying to get this in two. Or three. Actually, this is like super hard now that I think about it. Let's just see if we can get one in three. We can call it a win if we get it in three. How about it? I've only ever gotten one actual Wordle in two. Alright, give me a good starting word, guys. Statistically, what is our best starting word? That's right. Fart. <gasps> okay. That's, that could be worked with. Irate is not the best starting word for the four letter wordle, unfortunately. Tame? I would try tame. Tame? Which would be more likely? Tame or tail? I kind of like. I kind of like tame because it has the E at the end. You know? Jafiel? Don't type fart hyphen bean in my chat. No way. All right. Can any intellects in the chat figure out what the word might be? Anyone? That's right. It's meat. <laughs> you guys, do you guys think I'm stupid? Do you think I'm stupid? You think I was going to put meat there? Oh my god. All right, we got it in three. The question is... Do we, can we get it in two? Can we get it in two? That would be the pinnacle of my life. All right, we need a really good starting word though. <laughs> everyone, everyone likes bean. All right, we're gonna do bean until it's good. That's probably not enough. Probably not enough. I feel like we need at least one yellow and one green. Nope. 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 
Nope. Oh, dude, the four gray bean. <laughs> We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. <gasps> I wanted a, I wanted a yellow in there. We'll know. Guys, it's our chance. Best? Ah, oh, see, a lot of people think best. A lot of people think best before I even said it. We're doing it. It's best. It's best. Oh my god, the double gray. The double gray. What was it? It was Beck. It was Beck. That's nothing. Oh my god, dude. Two greens. You can't get much better than that. We're going to farm this. I wish I could do this faster. No, that's way slower. <laughs> no one has ever typed toot so enthusiastically in my chat before. Maybe should, should we have a better starting word? I hate to say it. Should we go with fart? Is fart a better starting word? I need some mathematicians out there. Toot is terrible. You get T and O and then O again and then T again. Stop suggesting toot. All right, fart has blessed us. Let's not squander this opportunity that fart has provided for us. Could be foot. Foot would be pretty, foot or feet. Fort? No, there's no R. There's no R, people. Felt. Felt is really good. Felt is really, really good. Please, this is the last time I want to ever see people spamming feet in my chat. I'm doing felt. Ah, oh, Foot? No! No! We had a chance to get foot! I'm sorry, I should have listened to the footies in the chat, dude. Oh my god. Oh, dude, foot win. It was a foot win. All right, let's let's try like a statistically good word. That one hurt. Let's try like tear. Oh no, dude, please. I'm actually having the time of my life right now. I don't know if you guys are or not, but I am freaking I think this is super fun. <laughs> I cannot believe that it was actually Freaking foot. Uh, what was I even doing? Tear. The double greens, man. It's That's what you need. The word was gout. I just glanced for a second and the word was gout. I wish there was a, a hotkey to give up. So I can cycle this more efficiently. Poop is not a good starting word. Ah, see, idea is probably good, but it probably won't get us like it doesn't get us a con like enough consonants, you know. Star is, is pretty decent. I do like getting, if we get a lot of the consonants, I feel like that helps a lot. <laughs> I hope they don't track my stats on this website. I'm gonna look like an idiot. We have an opportunity here. It's gotta be vowel, consonant, vowel, or consonant, consonant, vowel, consonant, right? Seam? Oh, there's so many. There's so many. I hate to say it, but I kind of want to go back to fart. Oh man, there's so, so many. Whoever suggested soup, that's not right. Could try soap. Stab, there's so many. Stab is not good. What am I saying? Stab is not good. 
How about in honor of the chat and for what every single person is doing right now, let's do stab. Oops. No, or spam. What am I saying? In honor of the chat and how you guys are behaving, let's try spam. Pain. Absolute pain. Soap? No. Slap? Probably also no. Scab? Slay? Let's try again. I'm going back to Old Faithful. One of these days, we're gonna get something that gives us enough info. You know, we're gonna get like two greens and a yellow. <laughs> Zach is a terrible starting guess and it probably won't even let me do it, yeah. Imagine, oh. Come on. Let me hear, what do you think? Fact, terrible, there's a T, already, guys, read. Fame, it's a possibility. Face, I feel like face is more likely, right? Face, fade. Oh, there's so many. I, I might try face. I, I think we just gotta try face. Go! <gasps> yes, dude! Yes, 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 yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, what a rush. I, I, want, I want you to hunt down the person that suggested face first. Let me look. I'm going up. I'm going up. I'm going to find the person. I'm scrolling. I'm looking. It was Koji. It was Kai- uh, Kier, I don't know how to say, no, say your name. I'm sorry. It was one of my mods. Koji was the first person to say face. What a time to be alive. They said we couldn't do it, but the hive mind overpowers all. This is probably the last time I'm going to use this website, honestly. But it was, it was freaking fun while it lasted. Oh my god. We are the smartest chat on the internet, guaranteed. All right, that's all I've got for that portion of the stream, dude. Well, I, I got so much more out of that than I thought I was going to get out of that, honestly. I, that was so much fun. Oh, very nice. Very, very nice, everyone. That was freaking fun. <laughs> dude, I actually had a blast going for that. It's like the perfect combination of like skill and luck. It's, it's mostly luck, but we are absolutely popping off right now. And who do we have to thank? We have one of my mods who came up with face, and we have the brave soul that suggested fart the first time around. Those are the two people that built the stepping the stepping stones that we uh, we eventually built Rome upon. Good job, everyone. I'm sorry. Pro someone probably also said face before Koji, but that was the one that I saw after I got fart. Uh, okay. Hey, let's uh, let me change my thumbnail and my uh, thing for a second here. There were 600 people watching me type fart over and over and over again. I was about to say, while we were doing that, I was about to say, imagine you join the stream at this very moment as I'm just cycling fart, give up, fart, give up, fart, give up. Oh my God, imagine. All right, I'm gonna change the uh, the thumbnail real quick, guys. Just give me a second. We are going to be doing uh, some Stardew Valley TikToks now before we embark on PowerPoint night. This is gonna be a blast. I freaking love these. They're a lot of fun. And then honestly, I think we'll probably, the way the timing is probably going to work out, I think we're going to do these TikToks and then we're going to have a little bit of time before PowerPoint night starts. And so I think I'm going to want to return to the Wordle website and try that again. Maybe we could try going for another, uh, another guess in two, but or maybe we could, we could try doing like a six letter Wordle or something different just to mix it up. But, um, <laughs> someone just typed Werb Werbdle in the chat. All right, let me change. What's the title going to be? Uh, Re, uh, the best Stardew Valley TikToks later PowerPoint night. I always feel like the way that I name the videos for the Stardew Valley TikToks and the, like, just both the live streams and the videos is always like the 
funniest Stardew Valley TikToks. These Stardew Valley TikToks are hilarious. Like, just stuff like that. And honestly, it's like, wow, is that really good? That, but it's how Ludwig does it. It's how what Ludwig does it. And all of these videos do super duper well. I guess it gets the point across good enough. So get your high YouTubes ready, everybody, because we are, uh, we're going to get ready to record at this very moment. <clears throat> It's time for more Stardew Valley TikToks. All right, that's the whole intro. Here's the thing. You guys all missed it. Every single one of you missed the intro. It was such a short intro. You all missed it. I'm going to give you another chance to get in there. Here we go. It's Stardew Valley TikToks. All right. I hope I hope you guys got in there. That is the shortest intro in the existence of my channel. <laughs> oh, man. All right. We are... Uh, let's see. Let me share my screen here with you guys. Uh, here we are. We are reacting to Rami, the creator, Stardew Valley TikTok compilations six and seven today. I scrolled ahead a little bit so I could get this picture for the thumbnail, but I have not seen any of these. <clears throat> oh gosh. All right. This is uh, also, first of all, tell me, is this loud enough? If I'm talking and there's audio playing in the background, can you still hear the audio? All right. This is your, uh, your forewarning. I have not screened any of these for cleanliness, so it may not be family friendly. So if you want to not hear any bad words, uh, you got 39 minutes until PowerPoint night starts. All right, I got someone say do it louder and someone said audio too loud. So I do not know what to do with that information. Got all sorts of stuff. We'll see. If it's, uh, if it's bad, we'll fix it. I'll do a couple and then we'll fix it here. Okay, here we go. Hello, it's me, Shane. Ooh. <laughs> this is something else. So the problem is, a lot of the, like, TikTok has no, this is, this is not going to end up in the video, but it's really funny. The The problem is, <laughs> because you're saying, what, LOL, what is happening? TikTok is like a Chinese-based company. They have zero copyright laws. It is the Wild West on TikTok. You can just do whatever you want at any time, all right? YouTube is not the Wild West. YouTube cares very deeply if you use copyrighted songs. And so Rami, when they make this compilation, they take these TikToks and sometimes they have copyrighted sounds in the background and they just replace it with like this tip, like this, like, like this, you know, default music. And it makes a lot of the TikToks not make any sense at all, but it's kind of funny at the same time. So we'll just ignore that. Bro, that was so good. Do you have any more? I agree, Sam. I really liked that Cast one. Away. Hey. We are hmm. We are yeah, this slaps. We are no Dude, these TikToks no are out of pocket today. Damn. I wish I was swag. <sighs> if only I was swag. Yo, I'm so swag right now. Dude, oh my god. Oh my god. Ah! <laughs> it caught me off guard. Hi, Dan. I just moved in next door. I'm a supermodel. I don't care who the IRS sends. I am not paying taxes. Oh no, he's being emo in his bed. At all times. They ask you how you're <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, that's like something I would expect out of Shane, not Sebastian. You're not really fine. You just oh man. It's tough. Okay. Can't relate. This mod is so cute. Ten tenths recommend. This is where I got the thumbnail from. <laughs> Shane is disgusting. I like how everyone... Wait, look how cute every single person is. Look at this. <laughs> look at how cute every single one of these people are. This mod Haley, is so cute. Leah, Sam, Emily, Shane, Penny, Abigail. <laughs> Woo! 
Sports ball. Woo, sports ball. Oh. 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 This man's got so excited he gave us a kiss. A <laughs> That's a funny reaction to that, honestly. No, please. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> yeah, she's no, hilarious. No, no, no. <laughs> please, sir. Feel free. I give you my consent. <laughs> oh. <gasps> oh, yeah. <laughs> Yo, her reactions to that. <laughs> I'm feeling truly blessed. On I came to this farm. Oh, I met cut a off. Man. I said, I looked him in the eye and I said, that's it. I fell in love with him. He's perfect. I want him. And then I was like, let me go see him, you know, check in on him. I like to stand at his doorway and watch him sleep at night. Oh, no. And then I went into his room. <laughs> And there's a woman in there. Where's Alex? It's Abigail. Abigail can do no evil. He wasn't at the saloon. Excuse me. I had a good day. I like to see my grandparents often. They're <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. That's so funny. <laughs> So, do you have fun with your little friends? Evelyn is sick. <laughs> oh my god, that's awful. Hello, Stardew Valley TikTok. I tried. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> that's a look. That is that is Mr. Key in the flesh. I tried my best to find out if anybody had ever cosplayed Mr. Key before and couldn't find a goddamn soul. If this is the case, I am ready and willing to take up the throne as your resident Mr. Key cosplayer. I have hidden 500 beans around this app and you need to find them with this. <laughs> I love the cutoff. She's the bean queen. Just takes control. Just absolutely takes control. <laughs> Mrs. Key, you guys are saying in the chat. It's Mrs. Key. I didn't read any of that. I'm an idiot. Am I more bargained for yet? I've... I mean, it's not my favorite, but I don't think I hate it. Be joking, Sam. This is so bad. Oh, Sam is trying his best. Can you do better? This is... Again, this is a perfect example of one of the, like, random songs that they used to replace the copyrighted stuff. <clears throat> I'm just now, internally, asking myself in quite a worried way whether I might... Oh my god. Oh no. Now that was a lot of damage. <laughs> I, I still don't know how M goes for Shane, honestly. I, I don't get it. You guys are like, I can fix him. Hey, Abigail, I got you an amethyst. How'd you know I was hungry? That's quite the edit. He just needs a little <laughs> shaping. To the salon! That's cute. to touch my butt while I fish. I'm just gonna oh. skip that one. Feels like Find the caption beans. maybe Gamble, could just be skipped my name over. Is Mr. Key, I'm immortal. Find my beans. Find <laughs> <laughs> run it back, run it back. Sebastian, what are you doing? <laughs> you wanna gamble? You wanna gamble, bitch? My name is Mr. Key. I'm immortal. Find, Find my, my beans. beans. <laughs> Find my beans. Do it. See, I say stuff like this. And then some people are like, you're my comfort streamer. And I'm like, why? <laughs> Find my beans, dickhead. Find my beans is like the epitome of that uh, that animation that Matt McCluskey and I did. It was not hard at all to find ridiculous things that Mr. Key has said for that one, honestly. Turned 
down many a time for a date. Or I've gone on dates and people, the other person doesn't think it's a date, but I think it's a date and then it's really awkward. But nothing has hurt me more than the sad emo boy on Stardew Valley not wanting to dance. <laughs> oh like, man. Boy. We've all been there. You live in your parents' basement. You're on your computer, probably on 4chan. You can do a lot worse. That's how I felt in the beginning, all right? My very first time I ever played, I think I've talked about this before, but my very first time I go right up to Emily and I'm like, may I have this dance? And she goes, no. And I'm like, I should have known better than to expect that someone such as yourself would ever stoop to my levels. And then I ask like, Maru. Maru, may I have this dance? And she's like, Ugh. No. Shut up, Maru. It's the me. As you can really tell, I'm quite pressed about this. And this happened like a good week ago. And I'm still not over it. Why wasn't I enough for you, Sebastian? Why wasn't I enough? Find my beans. <laughs> so what if I'm the monster? I'm still me, I say I'm the man. Yeah. Money add and multiply, I call it mathematics. <laughs> oh, it's the Sims. Ooh, okay. are super accurate, honestly. Uh, there's so many this episode that are taken out. getting married in my clothes. Like, girl, <laughs> you couldn't even dress for the occasion. <laughs> when your custom NPC is in a cutscene. Like, I know- That wasn't how I wanted to say that. It's- <laughs> When your custom character's in a cutscene. Clothes. Like, <laughs> I'm pretty sure Em and I got married and I was wearing a shirt with like a skull on it and like a grass skirt. And man, did I look fine. Or you couldn't even dress for the occasion. Like, I know that's my fault, but... Damn, he's so cute. We love Linus. Ah! <sighs> Dude, if I had a dollar. If I had a dollar for every time I ate something instead of giving it as a gift to a villager. <laughs> I honestly don't give that many gifts. So like that particular thing hasn't happened, but like maybe like once or twice. <laughs> Sorry for yelling. <laughs> that is really funny though. That is really funny. Imagine like in real life, you're, you're Linus, you're homeless, right? All you would ever want in your life is leak. And this person, the new farmer, runs up to you, full speed ahead, runs, holds the leak straight over their head, and you're like, my savior, my savant. And they just eat it right in front of you, stare you down for a while, and then run right away. And you guys wonder why the farmer is a psychopath in every one of my animations. <laughs> Sorry for yelling. <laughs> Oh, fine, I'll do it. They never went down to Georgia. He was looking for a soul to steal. He was in a bind, because he was way behind, and he was looking to make a deal. And he came across this young boy playing and playing that fiddle high. And the devil jumped up on a hickory stump and said, boy, let me tell you what. You can call me when you want, you can call me when you need, you can call me in the morning, I'll be on the way. Call me when you want, you can call me. So here's a mod Just that popping, you honestly. Well, three Emilys if you count me. <laughs> I don't know how much you like Emily, but I feel like three Emilies is maybe a little bit of overkill. <laughs> We're about to watch a Concerned Ape Haunted Chocolatier trailer, which I don't know what it's for exactly, but chat was just telling me about it. Oh my god! <gasps> That's so cute! Yay, Look little chocolate! Little oh chocolate! <gasps> I'm very excited for this game. That actually looks like her. <laughs> looks a lot like her. Oh, I'm so fucking gay. Nice. Oh, can't wait to spend all my time on this game. Shit. It looks exactly like her. I don't know how. I've never heard silence quite this loud. Hey, Sebastian. Hey, farmer. Would you like this egg birthed from the ass of a void chicken? Oh, uh, yeah, fuck yeah. How about this mayonnaise I made from the egg? Hey, that's fair. That's fair. You can like eggs and not like mayonnaise, you know? It's just says about you. I don't know what this is supposed to. I think I missed the first line. 
Oh, good, Matt. Good. I'm putting mine on then. I don't appreciate that. I'm an Abigail stan myself. Hey, stop being antisocial. I'm what is this aspect ratio? What is going on right now with this stretched res 2018 Fortnite? Hey, stop being antisocial. I'm right here. Get off your phone. Get off your phone. Get off your phone. <laughs> this, this stretched this stretched out video is honestly the funniest part about this look at the freaking time it's 6 40 p.m level it's a ploy sam it's a scam you know what these microtransactions are like oh. Oh. very nice very nice. <laughs> Alright, well that's that's one of two. I like the giant Wallagug arrow in the outro. Like, wow, Gug should consider that. This is like another, you know, extension of the Gug arrow. I love that. That was pretty good. What do we rate that compilation out of 10, everybody? What do you think compared to the previous ones? I think that was maybe, maybe like a 6, I think. There's some good ones in there, but I think there were a lot that had copyright, uh, copyrighted music, which brought it down a pretty decent bit. That's what I think. Yeah, it's it was like middle, middle of the pack, honestly. It's okay. There, there were some good ones mixed in there. All right, let's try the next one. This will help us. This will help us get where we need to get. It's funny, like this is how I enjoy video games when I'm not streaming. Like, I don't play Stardew, I don't play The Sims, I don't play Animal Crossing, like, that's not my kind of game. I play Halo, I play, like, Rocket League, I play, like, those kind of games, you know? And so, <laughs> this is me most of the time. It's funny, though, if you took Stardew Valley on the bottom and sped it up and then put this face on it, I feel like that's most of my streams. Five out of 10, no Shawnee. This is your man. Yes. Look at the screen. <laughs> That's mine. M, what do you have to say? What do you have to say about this? You Shane Stan. Every time I talk to M, it's like Shane is literally on the cusp of like having a mental breakdown. She's like, "That's my man's right there." And, I, and, I, and, I'm that's, and that's him. and that's what you're gonna settle for. I'm gonna stick beside him. Falling in love. Cringe. Cringe. <laughs> this yeah. man has one of the most disgusting personalities I've ever encountered. He's rude, he's narcissistic, he can't read. Would I like to hang out with him? No. Would I sleep with him? <sighs> yeah. Big time. That doesn't even look like Shane. False Don't advertising. Don't be gay. If I take a girl to flower dance, I don't get to wear the dress. You can get rid of the bushes? Tell me why I forgot. Oh my god. How is it that I have so many hours in Stardew and I forgot that you can get rid of the bushes? Isn't That's not a mod. That's like an axe upgrade, isn't it? Tell me how I'm just realizing that right now, please. Please confirm or deny you can do that. She just chopped the bush down. Look. You. Bush? You can get rid of the bushes? Why do I forget that? Why do I forget that? Don't LMAO me, all right? I know a lot about this game. That is one that I absolutely forgot about, though. Dude, what in the world? Why does my brain not work right? <gasps> Wait, did y'all say this was rare? How do I... <gasps> dinosaurs, what do I do with dinosaurs? Habu can Kill tell them? you exactly what to do. <gasps> oh my god, my man's about to die. <laughs> Not the fire! <laughs> no, uh, huh. cheese, cheese, cheese. The cheese, cheese of redemption? Cheese, 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 Where's the egg? 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 We need to get this egg. Y'all said there's an egg. We need to get this egg. I swear to gosh, if they don't drop an egg, 
I'm gonna be so freaking mad. Honey, you've got a big storm coming. Uh oh, no egg. Nothing? No dinosaur eggs? No dinosaur so no eggs. Dinosaur eggs. <laughs> Literally, how can I focus when they all look like this? My wife. My wife. My wife. She's so hot. <laughs> I've, yeah, I don't know. I've just I've never used any of the content patchers, honestly, like any of the portrait mods. Step on me. Where's the egg? Wipe her up too. I can fix you. Football. Doc, I'm sick. Oh my. Skate for lift. Emo boy. The text to speech on this is great. You sandy man. <laughs> you sandy man. Oh, there he is. Not to be dramatic, but I wanna die. This, this. <laughs> Sean is taking over TikTok as every individual person. You think he's just Harvey? Oh, no, no, no. Look at the stash on this thing. It looks like he has a cat and he just ripped it right off the cat. Oh my God, it's a furry stash. Yeah. I don't understand how you guys can stick with like giving villagers so many gifts. I, I just can't do it. Night's complete, I saw Shawnee do. He likes sashimi though, so that's like light work. Oh my god, not Willie coming down to look at me. <laughs> Willie, look away. He's gonna judge. Willie, He's look judging away. so hard. Oh god, not on the erratic fish. Willie, look away! <laughs> Willie, don't look at me! <laughs> Willie! You better Willie, clutch no. up in front oh of Willie. God, doing it? You better do Willie, it, come look on. Away. Look away, Willie! Willie! Look away. No, Willie! No. Stop focusing on Willie. Willie. Focus on the fish. I'm so invested. Yo, You're not gonna tell me the outcome of that? I'm so flustered I turned on closed captions. Dude, what? How are you gonna not tell me how this epic saga ends? Hey, Willy! Willy! Yo, why is it good in our fucking bedroom, dude? What? It moves? Get the <gasps> fuck out of here! Oh my god, you hit it on the head with a fucking hammer? <laughs> Excuse me, oh, I'm taking his. Oh, it's Willy again. <laughs> hey there. <laughs> Okay, can I tell you guys? We made, Evan and I literally made an animation. I had not seen this TikTok, but we made an animation that was exactly this. It was literally like Willy walks right up behind you and starts fishing. And it just didn't work out well with the way that we do animations. But this exact experience is like, I hate to say, but we've all had it happen. <laughs> Some like kid I got bonked. I am very bonked. uncomfortable with the energy that we've created in the studio today. Mm. Still never played this. <laughs> Storyline mods that shouldn't exist. <laughs> Wait, I gotta start taking notes for modded meadows. Linus Yeti. We got clatter teeth chickens. Sexy. We got Okay, we already have we already have Abigail Centaur. Number six. Monster men livestock. Dude, those are cursed. What do you what do you mean? Did you do this to search for my parsnip? Betty, <laughs> please! Let me out! Trapped. Me out. Full inventory. <laughs> What's going on in here? Sexy dwarf, dude. <laughs> please let me out! <laughs> I want us to be let out, please. <laughs> Jamie, help a girl out. Uh, I can't. Please. I can't. It's not my treat. Yes, you can. It's not. Oh, the dogs that's are so not even true. Right there. What do you it's want not about? my tree. That's Please. cat. Please. Freedom. You suck. Did you pick all the ones out here? 
asking my friend Natasha, who has never played Stardew Valley, whether she'd smash or pass on The Bachelors. Smash, smash or pass? It's a whole car full of people. Yeah! That's Maddie's husband. I didn't like Elliot <laughs> the second pass. I saw him. What? Controversial. Nope. Smash or pass? Hard fucking pass. <laughs> Tasha, smash Shawnee, or pass. Shawnee crying in his room right now after that one. <laughs> yeah. Okay, smash or pass? Smash. Yeah. Okay, okay, last one. Smash or pass? Pass. Aww, oh, Shay. <laughs> The simple solution is don't get caught digging, you know what I'm saying? It's the same methodology as picking your nose. This is cool. I've never done any cross stitching, but it sounds... it looks fun. Ooh! Spring! Nice! That's cool. Oh, we're gonna baptize it. I have zero idea how this works. Jeez, I just realized. Spring. That's really cool. Oh yeah, when 1.5 comes out, you just spend like three seasons on Ginger Island straight without doing anything else. <laughs> Someone took the time to make that. You silly, you can't squish rocks. Mmm, delicious. How would you do that? Sex is good, but have you ever gotten back to your farmhouse in Stardew Valley at 1.50 a.m.? No. Hey, I want to show you something. Come inside. Linus, what is this? Uh... Linus? Alright, that one hurt. That one hurt to watch at the end. Oh, good stuff! Good stuff! Thank you for the compilation and thank you to the awesome creators for making those funnies. Oh man, dude, that was a uh, that was an interesting <laughs> that was an interesting period of time that we just experienced together, wasn't it? Oh man, <laughs> that was quite interesting. All right, hey, we've got uh, we got like twelve minutes until the PowerPoint night starts, and I actually, real quick, I actually want to um, change up my PowerPoint just a little bit. I have the whole thing done, but I want stuff to fade in in a certain order, and I was literally working on this up until 7.29 and I didn't get a chance to finish it. So I want to do that real quick and we're also going to do our intro and then I'll probably hop in with the people that are doing it and uh, we'll talk for a little bit before we get started. But um, also I did miss during that time period. I'm sorry. Anna Wright, thank you for the membership. Welcome to the Flamboyance 43 minutes ago. I'm very sorry I missed it. And uh, Vice City 985 also, thank you for the five Canadian dollars. So sub to therm for the race. Okay, 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 that's fine. Thank you for the five dollars. No message attached. Just, uh, just straight five dollars. I appreciate it. Let me change the thumbnail and the title here also as I do this. As I say, it's PowerPoint night featuring Therm, Ring Queen, Charlie Barley, and Matt McCleskey. There we go. Alright, so I real quick, here's the deal. I want to update my PowerPoint real quick, but I also want to entertain you guys. So here's what we could do. Let me think. Let's do some QA. I can I can do something while I uh, while I finish the PowerPoint up here real quick. What do we want to talk about here real quick? This PowerPoint honestly is a very funny one. We'll do the intro after I finish fin after I finish setting this up here. Uh, do I want to do the animations? Yeah, no, actually, I think I won't. I think I'll just let it go one slide at a time. I wanted to have it fade in a little bit at a time. But I think that... I don't even know if I can do that now, the way that I have this set up. If I go fade in, I want only the one part. See, I have all of it in, like, one text box, but I want it into... That's going to be too annoying. We'll just we'll just rip it and, and, and 
we'll just rip it as is. All right, never mind. PowerPoint night. PowerPoint night it is. Um, sorry, no q and I was dishonest. Get your high YouTubes ready because we're going to do the intro to the video right now. <clears throat> and this is a fun one. Oh, how do I want to start this one? Because this, uh, this is a good one. It's always a great night. Actually, I before we start, I actually have to get my uh, my little suit and tie on. It's not a full suit, but I'm going to put a blazer on and I'm going to put my flamingo tie on, which is like hidden back here, I think. If you don't know, i got a green screen like right here off screen. And for some reason, that's where I hide my flamingo tie. That's where I keep that. So I got to get that and I got to get my blazer. Real quick though, thank you, Clara, for the $10. Said, here's money to fund the anti-daylight saving time movement. I'm glad it's that we're just talking about PowerPoint night right now. And you guys are remembering the powerful words that I had for you the last time. So thank you. I'm glad that I made an impact. This time is less of a uh, public service announcement and just more of a, I don't know, just sort of an observation of, uh, of the way that I experience Excuse me, the way I experience life. I'll be right back. I'm going to grab a blazer. But get your high YouTubes ready. Why, hello. Now I know what you're thinking, Zach. Is that a gray blazer? And gray sweatpants? You'd be correct. You would be absolutely correct. <laughs> All right, let's let's uh, let's get the tie situated. It's been a while since I put this on. I, it's been so long. I bet a lot of you guys have never even seen the flamingo tie before. This used to be a staple of the stream. And it was a, a channel point reward on Twitch. People could redeem it and make me wear the flamingo tie for an hour. <laughs> you look like the cool teacher. Awesome, thank you. I know, what a professional. Ah, there we go. <laughs> I am wearing a blazer with a shirt that says liquid assets. Royal Rumpus, thank you for the $5. Actually, no message attached this time. All right, now we can get our high YouTubes ready. Now that I am uh, properly dapped up, that's what it's called, being proper level of dapper. There we go, I'll button, I'll button for the intro. At first glance, it might look like I'm actually dressed up. That's what I'm going for. I don't wanna actually be dressed up though. Just wanted to maybe think for a second. You would think for a second that I am. <clears throat> Here we go. My people, there are important things that you don't know about this world. And that's why I got four of my most trusted friends to help you understand those things. It is PowerPoint night. Let's see what our friends have to say about the world that we live in. <laughs> I think that's funny. Um, I Yeah, no time limit this time. I didn't give any sort of time limit. Normally it's like, hey, 60 minutes, come up with something. Um, but this time it's just straight up the presentations, do whatever you want. Uh, we've got a lot of fun people. I'm going to go ahead and hop in a call with them now. It's just Matt sitting in here by himself. So lonely. Matt. Hello. Poor Matt, all by himself. <laughs> you know, I, I sent out the call to everybody, and I was expecting some people to hop in, and nope. Nope. Just me. I think I'm the only one streaming, too. Yeah, no, they're just not interested in hanging oh, out. good. How about that? <laughs> 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 so sad. Matt. Thank you for joining us. I know you're feeling a little under the weather, and so it truly is a blessing that you have given some, given us some time tonight here. Yeah, I was, I, was, I was down bad yesterday, but I slept 12 hours. I'm feeling better. Wow, that's crazy. I also slept 12 hours. I wasn't feeling sick, though. <laughs> Just... <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah. yeah, dude, the last time we did this, it was, uh, it was pretty fun. I'll say I've done this two other times. Like, you and I did it just this last time together. But I did it mm -hmm. two times before I had like any subscribers or anything. I did it with my friends from real life. And I had actual tears in my eyes when we were doing it. It was, <laughs> I, uh, I, I gotta go through just some of the, the best PowerPoints of all time. I had my roommate who so badly did not want to be a part of it. His name's Nate. He so badly did not want to do PowerPoint night. And I gave him an hour. 
And so he came up with like <laughs> the base. That was the thing. Actually, it was 90 minutes for the first one. My very first one was called 90 minutes, one PowerPoint. So I made everyone spend an hour and a half on a PowerPoint, right? And yeah. Nate said he made his in 10 minutes, like the actual content. And then he spent 80 minutes adding like pizzazz to it, like and like flying in <laughs> animations, all that sort of stuff. And uh -huh. his animation was called Cargo Vroom. And so it starts Good. off, it says, how car go? And all the letters like fly in individually and it's like, you know, like sound effects and stuff. And this is cargo yeah. vroom, vroom. And then there was this car that like zigzagged all over the screen, like all over the place. Like he must've dragged the pen tool around for like a good five or six minutes. It just zigzags <laughs> all over the place. And uh, and then it just went immediately. Uh, what did he do? There was something else that was, oh, oh, what was the thing? Oh no, how, oh God, hold on. There was another part. There was something that like wasted a lot of time. I don't remember what it was. There was something that like just took a super duper long time that was so Not worthless. Not the car driving around? I, maybe it was the car minutes. driving around also. But I remember something taking like a super long time and then he flips to the next screen and it says acknowledgements and there's like 75 <laughs> names. There were so <laughs> many people listed. Oh my God, it was so funny to me. That was so, so good. Oh, it was the DVD logo. Oh my God, Lin uh, Lerpa, thank you. My mom oh. reminded me. It, he had individually animated like 150 slides of the dvd logo bouncing around different corners and That's he made us watch okay. that forever then it got to the cargo vroom part and then it was acknowledgements and it, oh it was so stupid it was so so stupid it was great <laughs> for sure therm i know you're mad excited for this Mwah. oh what look at that oh no you can't because uh uh because you're hold on. recording can i can do the virtual camera, right? In I have no idea. Hmm, you could, that doesn't seem to do anything. It's okay. Oh, I don't I need it for set the up live. My, so. ugh, okay. Forgot well, I'm just, I'm going to use in the video, I'm going to use people's faces who record their face for it. So if you want to, you can do that, but it's whatever. It's my whatever. face will be on in a... Whatever. Whatever. All right, okay. the gang's all whatever. here. The squab. The squab. I Hold hope, on, let me get uh, myself. <laughs> Damn, I messed up. Rain and Charlie, I know that you guys are not going to be <clears throat> showing your faces, but I mm -hmm. hope that you're still dressed for the occasion. I am not. Oh, I... Look smart well, or smart? Well, Amateurs. what you don't know won't <sighs> hurt you, so. Just, well, you could have just said yes. We're not going to Yes, I'm yes. <laughs> Very well. I am wearing <laughs> the is... best outfit and... Uh, I'm envisioning it. A large hat. Is that hat bedazzled? Mm -hmm. It is. That yeah, is such a works. sketchy answer for, are you dressed nicely? <laughs> what you don't know a, won't you hurt ask? you. If the answer is yes what for saying ask? what you what you don't know won't hurt you, that is mad sketchy. <laughs> hey, I'm, you didn't I mean, ask me to not be sketchy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, hey, Thurber, are you setting stuff up still? Uh, I'll figure it out. All right. Hey, it's uh, it's just straight presentations right now. Who, so who wants to go first? Who's got a who's got a banger to open us up? I have uh, a banger, I have, but I don't want to open. I have oh. mine pulled up. I I guess I'm ready to go. All right. You know, the, the funny Matthew. thing is, we we didn't have a time limit this time. However, no. with the extra time, uh, I I think my PowerPoint came out overall a little lower quality than the last but it's fine <laughs> yeah it's oh progressive downgrade i feel that don't worry about it oh my gosh all right let me share my screen here How do oh we... and then okay. did everyone like i said keep stuff out of the bottom right generally or bottom left generally to make sure we weren't covering stuff up yes uh, uh oh hold on i need wait, to get how OBS is it recording. so like cleanly like shown mm, what yeah. epic dude I'll face what's the question Okay, I believe the questions were, end. how is it so cleanly shown? It's very nicely. <laughs> it's whatever. Scary, it's, it's whatever. <laughs> <laughs> That's a compliment, but also... Thank you. It looks lovely. End. Okay. As you can see, my presentation will be about using the website reddit.com. Uh, I, I don't know if you're Sorry. aware. Show of hands. Uh, and, and by show of hands, I mean you can say verbally. <laughs> Who here has used Reddit before? I have. I, a, I have not. used Reddit. I, I have. I yes. I am a minority. I <laughs> don't. Wonderful. Well, this this presentation is a hundred percent for Charlie. <laughs> I, 
I, I mean, I Charlie's going to be learning, know. and everyone else might be learning some things about the website that you didn't know. So let's let's begin. Okay. Yep. Not clicked into my window. Didn't go forward. Here now we you go. So yeah. you might be asking, can I use Reddit? And to answer that, we have to ask some more questions. Number one, are you unbiased? Are you an independent thinker? Are you a good communicator? And are you clean and groomed? If you answered yes to one or all of these questions, um, then no. <laughs> yes, oh, it's unfortunate. No, you can't use Reddit. Uh, so we're going to go off with the, some of the basics. By the way, I, I hand wrote this on my tablet. Yeah, and then I, I did. Yeah, I was going to say. Hold on. Just not a then, font. <laughs> then I got to my computer and to match it, I had to also write it, but I didn't have my pen. I had a mouse. And so some slides look like this. That's fine. It looks great. It's okay. I feel like this is harder. <laughs> this is harder to do. Right, yeah, why yeah. don't you just... This is more fine. work. Whatever. It was easier to handwrite, not to mouse write. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Personal uh, touch. The personal touch. The personal touch. Yeah. So on Reddit, you have subreddits, which are the specific pages for topics. Um, and Reddit is not social media because it's anonymous. I don't know. It's just not, Okay. Okay. Instagram is bad because they repost Reddit content, but Twitter is good because Reddit reposts Twitter content. Ah, uh, mm, good, good, good. <laughs> got it, got it. So, got what it. if you want to use Reddit? Well, you're going to have to follow these unspoken rules. Rule number one you must, okay, you must hate and downvote all reposts i need to get hold on i need to get my notebook yeah <laughs> should i be taking notes right now can you slow down matt <laughs> do, you, do, you, do you need me to go back you need me to go back yeah yeah i actually wasn't paying attention could you start are over? you taking questions <sighs> yeah i I, I, for, I meant to say this at the very beginning i'm not waiting till the end for questions if you have them fire them i'll answer yeah, i don't have any i just thought i would clarify <laughs> didn't think you did but i was gonna say that anyway okay okay if you've seen a post anywhere on the internet before you downvote it okay it's not new it's not fresh you hate it rule number two you must hate and downvote all original content because that's self-promotion uh. bonus tip if you moderate a sub you can ban people for posting their own work you have power so you can abuse it uh, matt i have a question abuse, noted, noted. Abuse power. Yeah, uh, yes so if the content is not my own and it's it can't be someone else's what can i post yes so rule number three if you see <laughs> if, if you see a, a comment or a post that has negative points okay it got downvoted you must dogpile and downvote despite whether or not you agree any other facts and logic disregard you must also downvote because monkey brain says do it mm. okay ah. rule number what? four why is every rule on the right side of the screen? Because <laughs> I was told to not put it on the left, so I can be on the left. How, that's a all the way to the right, cam, though. <laughs> who's who's going to be face camming right? over? Like, a Wait, let me, fix mine. let me fix mine. Let me fix mine real quick. <laughs> you know, okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? Oh, no, I wasn't. No, I wasn't ready. Keep going. I'm ready. No, I'm, I'm giant. Good. Okay, continue, Matt. <sighs> Rule number four: <laughs> You must add, <laughs> quote, edit colon and then whatever you changed in a comment if you edit it no matter how small the change oh matt we don't see the same slide as yeah, you we, we, matt sir, you're on slide sir, one sir, please you go. move your slide. We're, we're good we're good we're good we're good we're good we're on the same slide now Sorry, i'll get scared you're doing that was a good odd. job you're doing great anyway rule number five if your post receives an award you must add quote thanks for the award kind stranger to the end of your comment but remember rule number four because you're going to have to edit your comment to add that. So then you're going to have to edit. add. Thanks, thanks for the kind uh, stranger. Kind stranger. And I have a, I have a, edit. I have a add question. A thanks for the kind stranger. Yes, Therm. Um, if you were to follow this formula of adding mm -hmm. thanks for the award kind stranger mm -hmm. to the end of your post, wouldn't this technically be posting content that isn't yours and thus a repost? Mm -hmm. See, uh, yes, but it depends on whether or not you've been downvoted already. Uh, see everything is decided by upvotes and downvotes if you're upvoted everyone uh, else will upvote you if you've been downvoted everyone else will downvote you it's okay. a hive mind so okay. Just, okay. it's really it's really just up to luck okay that's fun i like luck. see for example everybody's gangsta until 
edit. Wow, this blew up. Thanks for the gold, kind stranger. I like it. Good example. Uh -huh. that, this this is proper merited. formatting. This is proper mm -hmm. formatting. <laughs> With that nice. picture. Been been there. Rule number right. six. Made up content is the best content. Fake. Bonus tip. Make your made up story sad for extra karma. Oh, okay. Okay. No one's going to question it as long as he told a good story. And even if they do question it, they're going to have such a good time pointing out that it's fake that it's going to perform well anyway. Uh, also, you can always say that everyone clapped. That also kind of comes in clutch. Everyone and clapped. Everyone yes, clapped. exactly. <laughs> yeah. Number Rule number seven. Uh, you are an expert. You know everything about any topic. Make sure as many people as possible know that. Okay. That's true. That's true. I get that one too. Mm. No one will question you as long as you say, I've been working in this field for so and so years, or mm. I'm actually a professional blank. True. And that goes back to rule number six made up content. Made up content yeah. is it's the it's best content. Circle. Okay. Oh God. I need a chart. I'm <laughs> <laughs> rule number eight karma is the most important thing in the world. Okay. Mm. Karma is calculated mysteriously by reddit and is put on your account depending on how many upvotes and downvotes you get bonus tip a good way to get karma is to pretend that it doesn't matter by saying things like karma is just fake internet points or i posted this to mm. see how many fake internet points i can get and people mm. will give it to you but remember it's actually very important okay that's what my grandma told me <laughs> she's wise mm -hmm. and number nine cake day is the most important holiday and now what is cake day well cake day is the day that you made your reddit account and oh. when it comes around the anniversary of you making your account you get to post and bait more karma because it's your cake day and now a bonus tip yeah. You can make a post about spending cake day alone for free sympathy, which again goes back to oh, rule number so six. Oh, good. Oh. Content is the best content. Mm. And now rule number ten. This is a multifaceted rule. Um, but some required <laughs> oh, uh, loves and dislikes for being on Reddit. So number one, you must love Keanu Reeves. True. Very important. Uh, Jack Black and Tenacious D for whatever reason Very you think true. they'd get more hate but apparently they don't Reddit loves Dis them disagree. number three ruining lives via <laughs> armchair detective work now if you'll remember back to the Boston Marathon tragedy Reddit <laughs> thought they had the guy okay <laughs> they berated him they posted him everywhere guess what <laughs> they found the people who did it and it wasn't that guy <laughs> wasn't that guy they had to apologize and reddit the website had to fix it um and you know that goes back to <laughs> oh you are an expert God. you know everything about any topic yeah. including being able to do intricate detective work at an event you were not present at and never investigated in person God. now you must hate fortnite okay i'm out kids I'm okay. Yeah. Kids. I can okay. stand by that. And, and <laughs> lastly, <laughs> <laughs> lastly, you must hate yourself. Already done. Checked off. Vibes. Now, after all of this, should you use Reddit? No, no it sounds awful. It's only for like super cool people. I mean, like you could, but like you wouldn't get it. You're so right. Mm. Thank wow. you for my presentation. Wow. <laughs> Great presentation, wow. Matt. Can I say the craziest part about that is that I have not used Reddit for about five years, and all of that was a hundred percent true five years ago. <laughs> not not one yeah, thing has changed. I don't that's know. how it goes. For those reasons, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff, Matt. Good stuff. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Beautiful. I still don't get it, but I did enjoy it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but it worked. <laughs> All right, I was who's just told twice who's next? that I can't. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but remember, you know everything. You're an expert. Mm -hmm. You are so for sure. Oh, yeah. All um, right, who wants it? I can go. Please do. Are your transitions right. faster this time? Uh, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
uh, how do I do this? Sorry, I'll, I'll figure Maybe it out. Maybe someone okay, should have done a presentation Sorry, on the that. the boomer. Mm. Uh, do you see it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Perfect. Okay, let me go oh. ahead and prepare myself. I love oh. this. Okay. Welcome to the most ambitious project of my YouTube career. This <laughs> is Pushing the Boundaries of MS Paint, a study into what it truly means to be an artist. Wow. So let's discuss the goal here. So MS Paint, for those who don't know, MS Paint comes with every Windows computer. It is a free bit of software for drawing. It's terrible, but it gets the job done because you can draw things. So I was sitting here and I thought, I wonder if I could make money, if I could actually turn a profit through commissions only making MS Paint art. Hmm. It would take a lot of networking, but it's probably possible. So I've created this challenge, and let me outline the rules oh of this. My also, God. if I do somehow make money from this, I will obviously refund it. I'm, I'm not actually going to turn a profit <laughs> from this, because that would feel morally wrong. Um, okay, the rules. I'm not allowed to reveal my identity. I'm not allowed to spend any more than five minutes on each piece. Luckily, I didn't come even <laughs> oh close God. to touching five minutes. I was absolutely <laughs> in the clear. Um, <laughs> mouse only. Drawing tablet is off limits. Wow. Uh, and I just have three days because I came up with this idea three days ago and ended up only using one of the days. So I only have one day. Okay. And our goal here is to learn about what it truly means to be and to become an artist. What is art? What is good art? What is bad art? Does it necessarily mean anything? No. Okay. Step one of this process. I need to assume an identity. So if you recall, stepping back. Can I do the pointer thing? Yes. Oh. If you recall stepping back, <gasps> Whoa, uh, identity oh. has to stay off limits, right? No reveal of the identity. This is so fun. I'm actually having a great time. <laughs> okay. Oh my no God. I feel like a cat right better. now. <laughs> no reveal. Identity must stay the same. Also, uh, same process as Matt's. If you have questions, blurt it out. I'm always ready. Okay. Cool. So I needed to assume an identity. And the step one of that would be to kind of get my, my MS Paint legs and create my first piece. Because I need a profile picture, right? And I need, I need a face for the internet. So I'd like you to meet this fellow. Uh, I think I know who that uh, is. Oh. <laughs> oh my. That is God. this Shawnee do. This lovely lad. <laughs> See, that's the thing. It wasn't supposed to be Shawnee. You know what? We'll get it's to that. Mustache. We'll get to that. Yeah, there's no there's no stash. This is just a dash. Burn just lad. ropes in the mustache into the lips in his own mind. It's, it's all the yeah, same. Alter ego. This is the lip. I don't think you're understanding that. It's okay. You'll maybe understand by the end. I don't expect you to catch on immediately. <laughs> yeah. I think so his background. Jeez. Oh, that took ages. Um, this <laughs> is my tell. this is my lad here, uh, and of course the lad needs a name. Mm -hmm. This is also a good exercise in developing my style. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, so everyone, mm -hmm. I'd like you to meet Doof Boompin. Doof Boompin, <laughs> sir. Boompin. So Doof Boompin is gonna be online. He's gonna be on the net, surfing the web, and he's gonna make some money. Mm. Doof Boompin. So let's explore Doof's digital footprint, shall we? So, we <laughs> yes, we shall. Um, oh, God. Step one was making a Google account. I also forgot you can screenshot, so I took a picture of it on my phone. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh my God. Um, so, uh, I'd like to point everyone's attention to the fact that boompdoof at gmail.com was auto-generated. So, Google <laughs> absolutely <laughs> dimed me up on that one. Everyone, please email that right now. <laughs> it is still active if you want to shoot me an please, email. Everyone, please email boomdoof at gmail.com a picture of your own MS Paint drawing. Oh, yes, I'm, no. I'm, I'm happy. I'll, I'll wow, make like a giant effort. collab piece with it. <laughs> so, Doof Boompin is now on Google. So, we are officially on the internet. And the first place I go is Twitter. Twitter has kind of become a hot spot for art nowadays. <laughs> one like oh, it's it's one like it. <laughs> ever since ever since the mass migration from Tumblr to Twitter, Twitter has really been a just a, a, a blossoming community for young artists and Doof Boompin uh, definitely falls under that category. <laughs> um, the main thing I had to do is I had to 
uh, make sure that it didn't sound like something I would write so people wouldn't get suspicious. So I started with something I would never say, which is greetings all, followed by two hearts. Um, I would literally never say that. Uh, my name is Doof Boompin, freelance artist living in Phoenix, Arizona. I don't live there, so there's no way they'll be able to figure Good it out. Right? Uh -huh. Sure thing. Uh, Doof. So excited to begin this journey. Commission's open, by the way. Check by. Just a subtle plug. <laughs> I thought I would let everyone know. Um, and and in the in the bio, I just kind of put my email in it, <laughs> and hoped that someone would shoot me an email. Uh, so that's uh, that's Doof's digital footprint. Oh, I forgot. Okay, also tw Tumblr. I forgot. We we also made Doof a Tumblr. Oh, you did go to Tumblr. Good. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So Doof is also He's like, on Tumblr, Tumblr is so dead. We're on Twitter. Also, I'm on Tumblr. Uh, <laughs> see, the key advantage here is that I took advantage of these hashtags down here. Um, uh, to, <laughs> not the NFT. To... No. This one I got some help uh, from my roommate. Uh, he was helping me throughout this experiment, uh, and he said do hashtags, and I was like, wow, I completely forgot. So I thought of the top row. Uh, the bottom row was all him. Oh. Um, he looked up what was trending on Twitter, and bye bye Spotify I was number one. So we just kind of threw it in there. Because that's how hashtags work. They go cross right. platform. Right? <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> exactly yeah. what I was thinking. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, okay, so that's Doof's digital footprint. Okay, I, all right, we also made him a DeviantArt. I forgot. God, okay, right. Doof is also oh on DeviantArt. Are, DeviantArt. are there any more? Are there any more accounts no. that you have forgotten about? Okay, never mind. We oh, my God, a oh, my God, Oh, my God. Okay, okay. Doof is on YouTube, and Doof does subscribe to Therm. Um, I mean, he's boosting his, himself on our brace to 100k. To? I can't believe it. Yeah, <laughs> the tragedy. Uh, also... I forgot to mention, I made one crucial mistake Just here one? that came back to bite me. <laughs> um, out of my own greed, I made Doof Boompin <laughs> follow me and no one else. <laughs> no. And also, no liked, one, no. and also liked Doof's tweet with my Therm account, <laughs> which okay. was a mistake because I forgot that tweets you like can show up. <laughs> he already blew the, blew the cover. <laughs> Not necessarily, though. We'll get to that. We'll get to that. All right. I, I, okay. God. I'm ready for so this. So that's his digital footprint. Okay. And an Instagram. We also made Doof an Instagram. <laughs> so Doof is on Instagram. It's all copy-pasted. Oh, and also a, also a TikTok. Oh, How did you forget about God. any of this? Next Doof Boompin is also on TikTok. And that's it. Thank okay. God. Oh, my God. So Doof is all over the internet now. You cannot <laughs> escape this kid. Christ. Blocked. And it's time to get busy. And this is where we really start developing and refining oh. our style. Oh, yeah. Oh, so Lord. we do a lot of, a lot of, a lot of studies, a lot of studies, a lot of exploration here. A lot of studies, oh a lot God. of exploration here. Mm -hmm. It's all about finding the style. And so this background with the crayon tool, this sticks around. This one's pretty nice. This background's pretty lovely. Okay, you stole that from Elmo, but okay. <laughs> no, I didn't. I stole it from my wow. heart and soul. Oh, okay. Wow. Shut up. So anyways, wow. Um, oh, doof and boop. <laughs> doof, doof takes no prisoners. Oh. oh my god. Um, the the big the big thing here that you can see is that this thick crayon outline begins to fade, mm. uh, giving way to a more clean cut style. Yeah. Um, that's what it needs. Exactly. <laughs> Looks much better. We do now. try again with the crayon oh. on this one. Oh. Okay. Um, and it, it really doesn't that? stick. So from now on, Doof has really narrowed down his style. Oh. Oh. So it's completely oh. hammered out at this point. <laughs> oh, yes. yeah. We that have it. Just perfection. We have it totally down. Doof knows his craft. Why do I love these? How, wait, how much? Are, that's, the, that's the appeal. How are much are NFTs? commissions? By You'll see. You'll see. Be patient. Oh, okay. 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 Be patient. Any questions so far before I move on? Are, are these oh, NFTs? No. They look like NFTs. <laughs> they can be. That's the appeal. They can be. They honestly do. They can be anything you want them to be. As Get long Jimmy as you fire on this stat. Boomdoof at gmail.com. Fire him an email. Oh so let's get serious now. Um, <laughs> we're on the internet, but we're on like the casual side. Let's make a fiver. Um, yeah. Fiverr oh, no. is a great place to get commissions. Uh, I write my Where? little description here. Uh, I describe myself as an experimental modernist artist with a concentration in character portraits, uh, which is what I would describe myself as. Doof Boompin did get the red underline, which is unfortunate. But <laughs> happens to the best of us. We we we're crushing it. I spend about thirty minutes making this Fiverr profile. It's a banger, and then we hit a bit of a snag uh, at the very end. See, I don't know if you noticed this little duber right uh. here. 
Um, unfortunately, it is actually illegal to file a W-9 for someone who doesn't exist. <laughs> um, yeah. Two. Yes. So, so never right. would have guessed that. Unfortunately, had to ditch Fiverr at the last moment. Oh, oh um, my God. So They're that lost. is a bummer. But there's always a silver lining, and this was a great excuse to really hammer out all the details of Doof's character and really get down who Doof is. Because I don't want to project myself onto this. I want it to be Doof's voice and Doof's vision. Mm -hmm. So this was a good exercise in really nailing Doof's character. Um... Which is just kind of me. Um, okay. Right. <laughs> from first someone in my blood. chat said, "Someone in oh, my chat said, the doof the tax evader." Oh my. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> I mean, a little. It, well, uh, you guys are like cerebral with this. All of this is gonna come back later. You guys are way ahead of the game. Um, so I guess look forward to that. Oh my gosh! Oh my Did you, you pay taxes? Did you? Yeah, well, <laughs> hold your horses. It, that okay? We'll get there. So, let's let's focus on the now. Um, right. Uh huh. Literally, not more than five minutes after I make all my accounts, I get something in my inbox. That is oh. Discord inbox, unfortunately. Oh. Uh, not my email oh. inbox, and it's one of my mods <laughs> on my channel asking me who is Doof Boompin. Uh, so I recover. I recover quickly. Playing it cool. Right, right, right. Playing it cool. Um, <laughs> and she buys it. Oh. Yeah. Thought it was a joke wow. account you made. Tempted to ask him for a commission just to see what he says. They're and this is exactly what I need to play into. The curiosity, the temptation. Mm. It's all falling Ooh. into place. And sure enough, I get an email. Yeah, baby, we got oh, her. Oh my god. We've got a commission you not even soul. 10 minutes after the beginning this of the challenge. This is fantastic. I found you on Twitter and I'd love a commission from you. What are your rates? Um I at this point I had a lot of thought about how I should approach this and I'm thinking it's probably smart to start small because I do want to have one transaction that I can use to establish myself as a creator. Oh my god. So I started off at two dollars. Oh my Since you're my first commission ever, actually I added it actually, so it sounds like a surprise. Um I'll draw you a picture at a discounted price. How does two dollars sound? Thanks a million for your interest. Doof boompin. <laughs> the email <laughs> and, we have a, and we have a hit. So she sends me this. This is a character that she created. Wow. This is her but own. She drawing. wants it boomed. She boomped. wants it wants a boom. Yeah. Once it boomed, it, precisely. Um, it is a fan oh character. Let me pull up. Oh my god! Alaska so actually told me what this character is, and I don't want to miss identify you this. Drag them um, in umbrella, this an umbrella academy fan character. Oh, is what this is. I've never heard of that before. Great show. Umbrella great academy. Show. Uh, oh, it's a show. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Out of It's 10. a comic and a show. Whatever you prefer. Ring Queen loves that and Cobra Kai. <laughs> Wonderful. Umbrella Academy is very good. <laughs> Cobra Kai. Okay. Original Cobra Kai. <laughs> so, Doof works his magic, and we have our first commission. Oh yeah, oh. baby! There it is. Oh. And there it is. Call Netflix. It, you can see call Doof, Netflix. Doof pulled out all the stops on this one. Doof is trying shading in the hair right here. Wow. Oh, Doof, Doof has some shading going on over here. I've never Look seen at such that. beauty. Uh, outstanding. The noodle neck. Um, the noodle neck, that is a staple of the doof style. Um, so things are really falling into place now. Um, and I decide, I again, I'm really trying to hammer home that I'm not desperate. And I'm trying to play this off as just an average everyday occurrence. Like no big deal. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, that's that's the truth. Casual. I'm sure that that is absolutely true that you really appreciate. It, it was. Them being a part it of was. <laughs> You could never It was know. such a godsend. I was so sure I was going to have this great idea for a PowerPoint and then would never get an email and it would mm -hmm. be a waste of time. But here I am making art. Mm -hmm. um, so now we've got some cash in our pocket. <laughs> to oh, invest yeah. in the business. And it's time to mm -hmm. splurge. And I go over to Amazon.com and find this little number. What on earth? Um, for $1.90. Please tell me those are actual gummy bears. In yeah, budget. what? No, it's not. It's a bracelet. Okay. Oh. Um, they're plastic. Um, 
I found the DFG DSF Simple Lovely Candy Color Bear Bracelet Multicolor Bear Bracelet Accessories for a dollar and ninety cents. Gotta love product titles. Oh, but uh, Therm, I got bad saved news up for you, for the man. Tuxedo. What's up? So, What's wrong? So you're you're trying to buy this with your commission money? Yeah. It's it's two oh two with tax. So I am gonna oh. have to be a little patient, unfortunately. Okay. <laughs> oh no. I am gonna have to be a little patient. And as Z has spoiled for everyone, impatient oh, little I'm idiot. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, the twist. <laughs> no, it's two three. Not three cents. No. Three. Just barely over budget. But then my roommate, and this is not how this works because I was paying with my own card, but I'm going to use use it as an excuse to buy this anyway. Uh, Doof does not exist and is therefore not eligible to pay taxes. Um, so we're going to write that off as whatever and buy it anyway. <laughs> that's how it works. Because okay. that's yeah. how it works, precisely. Huh. That's science. Um, okay. This is the one slide where I will not be taking questions. Everything else is open. <laughs> uh, okay. okay. You'll be taking questions from the IRS pretty soon, it sounds like. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. So um, I'll be looking out for this probably around mid-March, maybe early March. Oh, my. Because um, it is on the way in transit. What? Wait. What but we're not done. That? Oh! oh! I chose no. that because it's the only thing I could find that was around $2 with tax included. That's fair. That's fair. Okay. Mm -hmm. We're not what? finished. Oh my! We're not finished Never because ends. shortly after, I find a second email in my vague mailbox. Vague screaming oh, from vague screaming. vague screaming. I saw your art on Twitter and I love the style. How much are commissions? Um, <sighs> so I reply, and this time I try to step it up a little bit in the <laughs> price department. <laughs> oh boy! Since I'm pretty sure now that I have a commission under my belt, I've got the hook. And I oh, think yeah. I can convert. Um, unfortunately, that is not the case. Vague Screaming is not interested. Well, just slightly out of the budget. Uh, thanks for getting back to me so quickly. As fair, and, as fair oh. and reasonably priced as your commissions are, they're just slightly out of my budget. Wish you all the best in your future work. Vague, mm. ah, Screaming. Uh -huh. <laughs> so it's nickname. a blow. He goes by ah. He goes by ah. ah. <laughs> so it's a blow for sure. It, it's a bummer. Um, but... It's important to stay on your toes in times like these and just keep moving forward. Don't look back. <laughs> Why would you do that to make screaming? Good, good business move. And just wow. save face. Oh, no. Saving oh, no. face is the wow. key here. Doof is never going to make no this chill. industry. Doof is no getting chill. a little impatient. That's the bummer. Is that Doof is kind of losing his resolve. Doof so is now, not, not there. No. After after this point, I don't get a single other email for commissions, so I need to make the dismount. Um, and I'm thinking, how do I just? I don't. Do I just ghost all these accounts forever? Um, but then, the answer falls right into my lap, uh, as I get messages in Discord. And just like that, I solve my problems in the same way I solve all my other problems by pinning it on Shawnee. Oh, oh man. Oh, Lord. Shawnee. So, Shawnee, you have oh, now no. inherited Doof Boompin. I hope you are ready to take the responsibility. A big responsibility. What? Oh my God, dude. What a. You got to overturn the Doof. What a dismount. Um, in conclusion, it is possible to make money with MS Paint. You can do it. And this is proof. Granted, there's probably no shot I would have been able to do this if I hadn't accidentally liked my own tweet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but the point stands. Um, know your worth. Know your worth. Never um, overextend. <laughs> Always know your worth and stick to your guns. Never let anyone push you around. <laughs> Good. Okay, right. because you know your worth, and that's what's important. Mm -hmm. Okay. What would Doof Boopin do? I'm gonna yeah. cry. That's oh exactly. Beautiful. That is exactly Oof, what I was thinking. It's beautiful. Um, and yeah. So, in conclusion, about it, like answering the question of what it means to be an artist. Um, pretty much nothing. Uh, it doesn't right. really. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Doesn't really wow. mean much of anything. Woo! And that is Wait, that. So I have a question. This happened all yes. in one day. Uh, it happened in one hour. Uh, wow. <laughs> Maybe two hours. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah. Any questions? That's great. From anyone. Thank oh you. Oh my 
God. No questions. I just am taking admiration questions. for Doof. I will say that during that, I I did get some fan art sent to the oh to the email. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna have to check that really quick. Okay, oh well let me go ahead and stop wow. sharing. Oh, good stuff there. Boy, good stuff. Oh Thank you very much. Wow. Hey, who wants while we check Doof Boopkin's Beautiful. boom and business Doof right Boopkin? now? I'm sorry, I don't it, know okay. his name. I <laughs> forget. It's Doof Boom Pin. Doof, right? Doof Boom. Not Doof Boom Doof. Doof Boom, Doof boom Pin. Doof Boom Pin. D-O-O-F. D-O-O-F. Doof Boom Pin. Yes. B-O-O-M-P-I-N. Doof Boom Pin. Doof Boom Pin. Doof is Boom Pin. You know how he be. Doof Boom Pin and Doof Pin and Doof and... Oh, the bye fam. Um, hey, who Stewart. wants to go next? We should pick what? up the pace a little bit, I think, on our presentations. Mm -hmm. I think that I, you don't... Fast. Yeah, Charlie, yeah. I don't know what you were... I Mine's super go. fast. Mine, yeah. Well, here's the you thing. I told everyone. Go. I told everyone to have a three to four minute presentation, and Therm just presented yeah. for twenty minutes. So he's the worst. Oh in was that twenty? Yes. You did that last time too. You're the worst presenter. You get I'm minus sorry. points. I like time myself told you, before this. I told you this presentation was worth sixty percent of your grade, and if you go over, that's ten percent off. Yay. So it's not looking good for you. It's like half a letter grade. But it did like make me shed a tear. So like I was so something. sure it was gonna. That felt like five minutes to me. No, Time it flies definitely felt longer than Boof that, is around. but it's okay. I blacked out. That's my butt. That's my bad. <laughs> it's okay. No, you're good. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I had to tell a story. <laughs> Z, do you want to go first? Or do you want? I, I want to go you last go if first. I can. Then I think. Okay, I, I okay I'll go then. Yeah. I'll right. go then. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Oh, I love uh, this. Wow. I also. Like... This is random. Can anyone hear? There's like a garbage truck outside. Can you hear that? I just want to make sure. Not really. Nah. Not. Okay, good. Just, just check in. Just check in. She's in a plate for the garbages. Enhance. Oh my god. Okay. Hello. So. <laughs> oh my god. So, welcome to my presentation. I'm really excited to be here and to have the opportunity to present on a topic that I've always been really passionate about. My presentation uh -huh. is going to be about why Stuart Little would absolutely clobber Remy what? from Ratatouille in a fight. I, okay, just shut it. Okay. I, I so, need new friends, Mel, my God. No, do <sighs> not even, just look at my presentation and be shown the truth, okay? Okay. Okay, so. <clears throat> <laughs> okay. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> That's two, three, four, oh, five. Oh, this, there they are. <laughs> not on this slide. Not on this slide. Six. Okay. I got them all. Okay, for your viewing pleasure, I have hidden some Remy's in this presentation, and not all of them already. No, they're not on this slide. Okay, okay. sorry. Just like Stuart Little would hide Remy after okay. he murders him, right? It's true. Um. Yes. Okay. So. <laughs> <laughs> Our first. Rin, get it together! Get it together, Rin, come on! <laughs> okay, our first um, chicken contender is Remy. So, Remy is a rat child of the streets that was force fed garbage by his father, Django. So, we have here is the big man himself, Django. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Also, some other supplementary <laughs> photos I <laughs> <laughs> that just made me laugh, so I included Yeah, that. wow. The one on the right is, is right? kind of going through it. You got Doof Boomkin to... <laughs> <laughs> Doof Boomkin! <laughs> Fired up that one in the his middle. His style has, has traveled. Yeah. Just wow. the dread in his eyes on the right, I feel. I don't know, something I, about it. Um, it it's but, more acceptance. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, so Remy didn't want to eat his garbage. No, no, he didn't, so... <laughs> He just, uh, his dad told him to eat his garbage, and Remy was like, I do not want to eat my garbage. Instead, growing up, Remy always <laughs> admired Chef Gusto, and he dreamt about being a famous chef as well. He was really, this is so loud for me, can we? <laughs> it's it's good for me. <laughs> oh, okay, wow. cool. Oh, it's just like... <laughs> it's on a loop. Over. Just go, just go. <laughs> okay. He wanted to be a chef as well. He was inspired and, you know, anybody can cook. And he was like, anybody's me. I want to cook. And that was the dream he worked to achieve. And there are a lot of obstacles in his path. He almost got shot by an elderly woman. He almost drowned like 20 times. And also he was like captured on numerous other occasions. But those were like a little <coughs> less important. So it's not as big of a deal. But anyway, in terms of the fight, let's talk about some of the things that Remy has going for him. So to begin with, 
He worked as a chef in a fast-paced, high-energy environment where he had to like think on his feet and do what he needed to to survive as a chef in a high-class restaurant. And not only that, but physiologically speaking, rats are much bigger than mice. I have a diagram here. There's a rat and a mouse and a pencil. And the rat is pencil-sized, whereas the mouse is sub-pencil size. So you can see there kind of the I'm the pretty sure difference. that's actually the scientific term. Yes. yes, it is. I'm a biologist, so you kind okay, of have perfect. to me. Oh, you do yeah. well on Reddit with that lie. Rule number seven. Rule number seven. <laughs> yeah. All right. So we've already established that Remy can take a hit. He's been struck by lightning. You know, he's like been shot at with a real gun, nearly cooked in an oven. This guy has been through it. But by far, the biggest pro for Remy and the only reason he's even like in the running is his human vessel, mm. Linguini, mm. right here. <laughs> So, <clears throat> in the in the the hit film Ratatouille, we can see that he has the ability to control a human and manipulate their body movements. Like if Linguini <laughs> was down to fight, or like even if he wasn't down to fight, Remy could just tug on his hair and like stomp on Stuart or mm. something, right? I'm sure that's mm -hmm. what you're thinking. But mm -hmm. that's the thing is without Linguini. Remy is literally nothing. Like Remy has nothing <laughs> wow. going for him. And that is imagine, that is fast. Imagine. Actually though. So but you he know can cook tasty food. Yes, yeah, so this tank. is a fight therm, okay? I'm trying to imagine this PowerPoint if you take the title slide out and just send it to someone. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my yeah. god. I wrote an actual article on this that was like published, but we don't need to talk about that. So yeah, from the okay. information do, that I've already presented, there is no doubt most people would think Remy would emerge <sighs> victorious in a fight because like, right. you know, people have bad opinions and that's okay. And no. I'm, I'm not so sure. I think like, sure, Remy's been in many life-threatening situations, but ultimately he is the wimpiest of all rats. And he often complained he wouldn't even eat the trash that his family was providing for him. So on mm. top of his probable malnutrition, literally the only time Remy has been physically strong or able to ward off danger was with the help of his large rat family or his human vessel. But like, that's the thing. That's not what this is about. This is about a battle to the death 1v1 Remy versus Stewart, you know? Uh, That's let me just what I'm take saying. a moment to, to, question. to yes, cover yes. the fact that... Go, go ahead, there. Go ahead. No, 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 no. It's all you, brother. Um, he's malnourished for not eating trash? If he doesn't eat the he's trash, he doesn't eat anything. He's a, he's he a rat. He eats strawberries and cheese mixed together. My yeah, man, once he gets his human straw? vessel... No, once he goes to the grandmother, I will fight you on this, Charlie. <laughs> No, he steals. Oh, he finds Rin's a mushroom. Oh, Rin's not on board with this. I. Oh my god. He finds uh, a mushroom and he steals saffron from the old lady. Okay, he doesn't steal the food from the old lady. But anywho, can so I, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> yeah, I need to hear this part. Stupid yes. little punk. Um, yes. My question is: so you you've said a lot of things aren't shouldn't be considered because this is just a one on one fight to the death. Mm. In that case, uh, why why is refusing to eat trash a detriment in the ring because he's <laughs> malnourished you guys, yeah i agree with charlie he's eating nothing instead of trash which is well, no, like, no 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 here's the, but here's the thing Rude. but here's the thing you didn't specify when we see remy do you mean remy at the beginning of the movie because that's very different at the end of the movie of course he has <laughs> access to food because he literally is allowed to Those roam free in the largest points. kitchen in france those no, are points that should have been made. Fair point. Mm -hmm. See, well, we can assume just Remy included, in his base state. That's a lot of munchies. But she included oh, a plus okay. that he worked in a high-paced okay. environment. If he has worked hmm. in a high-paced environment, oh. then we've surpassed the trash problem. That's, that's true. Charlie's in some hot okay, water right now. Keep going, Charlie. Keep going. No, here's the thing. No, I don't still keep going. Even... Explain yourself. I'm about to. Yeah. <laughs> here's the Let thing. Even... Even if Remy is nourished, which I still think, like, you know, he's kind of kind of iffy. Even if he's <laughs> nourished, Stuart Little would still win, and here's why. Our second chicken tender <laughs> is Stuart Little. God, and, I'm like, going to flame Stuart Little so bad. we we'll to the end of this. Go ahead. You got some convincing <laughs> to do, Charlie. The only thing that needs to be said about Stuart Little is he, is, he has a 300 IQ, and he is a New Yorker. He, you know how the New Yorkers oh, are. He also true. drives a sick whip. <laughs> like, first of all, he could like run over Remy, but we're not talking about that. But it's fine. 
So like Remy, he's an orphan of the streets due to his parents' involvement in a tragic accident with a tower of cream of mushroom soup cans, mm -hmm. which left him to rely on his ingenuity to navigate his teenage mouse life and also the dangerous streets of New York, which, you know, that that means something. Oh, I, sorry, go ahead. Yeah, I, I found I, one I, of the I, hidden I, Remy's. Wait, sorry, I found two. I found two. I forgot about the hidden Remy's entirely. There was one on Gusto's pan. When you showed Gusto all wait, them I, all those I, minutes ago, oh no. and there's one on the next slide in the I top a, left corner. I have I, a question. I have two points. Uh, I, <laughs> I found six at the beginning, so I'm winning. Also, <laughs> I have a question. Yes, what's your question? I'm, I'm not trying to like. I'm not arguing for Remy. I'm still neutral on this. Mm -hmm. I'm. I just want to say that if you use ev as evidence that Stuart Little can run over Remy with his whip, why oh. would yeah. why would Stuart have access to the whip oh. if Remy doesn't oh. have access to Linguini. No, that's why I said it was a different issue. That's why I said it was a different issue. Is okay, he that's could, fair. But he won't because it's but not really... But he won't really... because he doesn't need it. Like, assuming that they both come to the fight fairly, which, like, you know, is kind of if They're literally like, rats. No knife, no yeah. gun fight. Right, right, like, right. Or one of them like, is we don't... at least. I don't know. I'm going to, like... You'll see. It's fine. Okay, so he's cool. cool. He's charming. He's charming. a good God. friend. Charming. Unlike Remy, oh who... God. I am mean. seething. I am seething. <laughs> Remy like destroyed Linguini's culinary career, and no, I like I like Stuart Little. I vibe with this. Thank you. And I'm he's really so just mad. an all-around great and clever mouse. Like we can we can I can agree on that with Therm and pretty much only Therm. No I think. false. So, so false. I like Stuart Little. Let's go through a list of a handful of his talents. I think the question here is really what can't Stuart Little do? He can do everything. He can sail boats. He's on the soccer team, which speaks to his athleticism, his ability to think on his feet. He looks okay. like he's totally in control of What do you mean? He situation. has full control of the ball, yeah. He has full control. He's he has his whole body on that ball. You don't that was, think he can... Uh, that was Ring Queen playing Rocket League this weekend. the ball squashes him. That's oh, actually yeah. handball. It's, in fact, two handballs. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's actually FC Barcelona goals. game. He's on varsity soccer. And, mm. he, yeah, he's strategic. He can think on his feet. He's athletic. Again, drives a sick whip. He's so cool. Also, he built a plane out of straight garbage, like combs and stuff. That's and not fire. only did he build uh, it, but he flew it. But like, Ratatouille Remy's eats garbage. Could, yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah, No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Family. No, 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 he won't. Family eats Again, trash. he doesn't have access to his family. See, now I'm with Charlie because you can't use that as evidence because we have discussed at length yeah, that he does, won't eat why garbage. Why does he get access to garbage no, then? Actually, just let me say, I anticipated that you guys would jump on this. So I have a slide literally like right <laughs> after this one that's going to talk about that. So oh let's just God. talk about it. He is not only a pilot, but a genius. And then I say, now trash. I can tell what you're thinking. How are these skills practical in a fight? Well, not only do they prove that he is intelligent and strategic and physically fit, but we also know he can use a bow and arrow, oh. and he's, he's literally mm -hmm. already murdered a predatory <laughs> no. human, as seen in... Uh, That's absolutely true. Figure B. So... If you don't think this is enough, if you're you're talking about all the different things, let's talk about how Stuart Little is fluent in English. Like, sure, Remy can control one human or have, like, his rat family, but Stuart Little is so charming and beloved by all that I'm sure if he just had a little chit-chat with the kids on his soccer team or his soccer coach or even is, his own family... Remy, is that a, a head chef! Remy is a head chef in a I restaurant! I have a question. I have a question. I have a question. Yes. Is that a tiny Remy on, like, in the top right picture on the father's neck? It looks like Remy, doesn't it? I mean, it isn't, it's but you can think it's whatever you want. Things. It looks like his little nose, no and he's got, like, a little hand hanging down. Neck. I like wish I He's always neck. watching. Good try. Also, Keep your eyes peeled, right, though. I like that awareness. He's literally driving his car in school. That's so yeah, that's Freaking it. smash it. Step like, on it. What middle school kid wouldn't rally behind this guy? I have a question, Ren. Why Why do you hate Stuart Little? You will see. Yeah, you'll... Okay. Also, just on a like on a on a point, if we're talking about the humans here, because I know that's all you're talking about. Even though they're both rodents, I don't know if you've seen a rat, but I lived in the city, and rats would like play outside my front door, and they were so like ugh, they were so gross. No, 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 I would not help a rat. But <coughs> I've also seen mice, and they're so cute and adorable. I would put my <laughs> life on the line for them. To be perfectly honest, and that's anecdotal, so we know that that's good. Anywho. True. 
Stuart Little is equally, if not way more resilient than Remy. And the thing that sets him apart is that when Remy's in a dangerous situation, he runs away or he relies on others to save him. But Stuart Little does the exact opposite. Like mm. Stuart Little can think on his feet. He comes up with ingenious solutions to problems and also isn't afraid to fight for his family and the things he believes in. Like he killed a predatory falcon on his own using um. like the laws of refraction and an airplane that he MacGyvered together. Like we can't gloss over this. He's <laughs> smart and he's like good. Like, why do people hate him? I don't get it. I don't either. Okay. Lastly, we have the, the cons for Stuart Little. You may notice this is a blank slide. Stuart Little has no cons. <laughs> He's charming, intelligent, hardworking, resourceful. Overall, charming, a very good imagine. mouse son and brother. And if you hate him, you're just mad that he is everything you're not. Thank you True. so much for coming to my presentation. <laughs> I hate this presentation. Yes. 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 I hate this. Uh, that picture right. is edited. So edited. Photoshop. It is not. There's no way that he so would correct. Uh, yeah, he's lifting hold Mjolnir. Yeah. Absolutely not. Mjolnir would not lift for Stuart. This Stewart. is slander. You know no, I, I think he's you know worthy. Look, imagine. Imagine. Okay. You are. You're four years old. Okay. Your mom's been in the hospital for like most of your life. She's been sick. Um, she finally passes away. This is a very fun Matt. Yeah, man. Yeah, no, just listen, listen, just, just listen, listen, listen. And your dad cracks under the weight, and uh, he's no longer around either. So you have to go to an orphanage, and you spend. Wait, before you say there. that, before you say that, I think I should start my presentation. Oh, let's go! Are you about to flame Stuart in your presentation? I think we should. We should. We should. Find okay, it. I go. trust Rick. Let's Thanks go. Thanks for watching, everyone. Charlie, I thank you. Therm and only <laughs> Therm, maybe Z. I think. Charlie, that I'm was great. Understood the the Stuart Little hate. I'm Can all... I tell you something crazy, Charlie? Please, is that please that is do. the second <laughs> Ratatouille-based PowerPoint that I've ever had in a PowerPoint night. Is it actually? <laughs> yes. It's it's a worthy topic. That is There's also, a lot to discuss. That is also the second time I have viewed Ratatouille fan art as a result. <laughs> Sorry. I'd like everyone to put their attention onto my presentation now. Oh my what Lord. in looking. the world? <laughs> Go! Did so, <clears throat> I present, Stuart Little is a menace to society and I would like to punch him. Did you plan this? Absolutely Honestly, no. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I haven't thought about either of these things for years. This has to be planned. No, it wasn't. <laughs> wow. We literally did it. That's okay. pretty incredible. Okay. Let me let me present, okay? What the heck? So, I know what you're thinking. Um oh, I forgot about that, right? Yeah. E extra hate on to Stuart Little. I know what you're thinking. <laughs> what? Why why is Stuart Little, America's C list celebrity mouse, a menace to society? Well Yes, why? There are many Whoa. reasons, and I will outline them all today. To give some backstory for people who don't know this pesky little mouse, even though we just heard about it, I'm going to say it anyway. Um, Stuart Little is in a 1999 film and the sequels after it called Stuart Little. That's it. That's the background you're getting. Also, um, spoiler warning for Stuart Little, um, but if you haven't seen it at this point, you just shouldn't watch it because it's not worth it. Oh no. <laughs> Let's start with reason one. Oh my god, the, I mean <laughs> you what? Adoption. You don't yeah, like Stuart Little because he's adopted? That's terrible. Like this is the, the biggest page. reason and the only reason I need, but there's more, so don't worry, we will get to it. So first the adoption. Yes, I said adoption. Stuart so Little cute. is a mouse. And he is in an orphanage, not a pet store, an orphanage, among other human children. <laughs> yes, human! And Stuart, the main character of this franchise, let himself get adopted when there were so many kids there. He let those what? poor, parentless orphans watch two capable adults <clears throat> adopt a rodent instead of them. Oh, I have a question. He manipulated. I have a question. Yeah, that, that one. Absolutely not. That's pretty tough. He well, manipulated. No, that, she's He's not accepting too. questions. Wait, but yeah, you gotta, you gotta accept refutation or it's not a sound argument, Ren. He is a rodent. But he's, he's a, a rodent he's kid. He's a rodent kid, but why is he among human children? He has full sentience. That's the thing. He has full He's, sentience. He has full cognitive abilities, which means that his life shouldn't be worth any less than a human. Thank you, sir. A rodent. Yeah. 
when they could go to a pet store and get a pet mouse because he's want. not just pet a speed. mouse he has that's he the thing he's english he has a he has cognitive capabilities of a human being just if not better he okay english doesn't mean he has more well, please, value please proceed. Okay? Need, proceed proceed this, this, sorry i'm sorry okay. this is not he civil this is not what socrates would have wanted We'll right, go at the end. Right. We'll go at the end. He he manipulated these parents with the notorious cleverness of a mouse and forced them to take him home with them. And we're just supposed to be okay with that? I don't think so. I absolutely do not think so. Reason two, the brother. Now, George. let's be honest. Let's be honest. Siblings already have a hard time competing for their parents' love. <laughs> uh, I've, I've gone through it. You've gone through it, maybe. I don't know. You automatically love and hate your siblings based on scientifically proven uh, case study that um, I didn't just make up for this presentation. Um, so imagine your sibling Rule is a six. mouse. Rule seven. Your Nine. your parents. Six, actually, sorry. Uh, your sorry. parents <laughs> chose to bring home not only a sibling to rival with but a rodent to rival with. You Dude, have to fight for affection with He's a mouse charming. that dresses fly as hell and somehow won their ha hearts over the <laughs> all of the other human children at the orphanage. You're screwed, you're humiliated, and you are definitely not the favorite child. And that is trauma. Reason it's three. not his fault. Why no Stuart epic. Little. Reason three why Stuart Little is a menace to society is privilege. None of us are unfamiliar with privilege, okay? Especially in our society. But Stuart Little's privilege is one that has plagued the rodent community for too long. He has a convertible. I mean, he has a ginormous bed that could fit a whole colony of mice, all for himself. Then, he there's this, this picture of a cursed mouse that's probably him as a CEO because he <laughs> gets everything handed to him. Then... This this guy, I can't, he just gets everything handed to him. Meanwhile, there are other rodents out there who work hard. I found a Remy, I found a Remy, I found a Remy. <laughs> These nice, rodents shouldn't have to work as hard as they do to get what they get. Remy should have been able to become a chef with no issues, but rodents like Stuart leave him and the rest of his fellow rodents in the dust. Remy owns a restaurant that's really expensive. He that's owns expensive it after trying cars. so hard to own it. He had to hide his identity in a hat to get to where he is and be successful. He had to work hard. Rin, and I next wanna, reason why Stuart... Just, yes, real quick, Rin, yes. I, I just want to make sure you're aware that your tabs are showing at the top of the screen. Oh. Um. Okay, <laughs> next reason why? Um, the murder. You heard me right, that's murder. And it was mentioned before, but I'm going to say it anyway as dramatically as I can. In Stuart Little 2, released in 2002, Stuart commits a murder. Now, Bumble. first, I, 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 would, I would like the jury to view the victim, a hawk trying to survive life as a hated bird in New York City. Next, the monster, <laughs> the monster, a.k.a. Stewart. Stewart abandoned his airplane to crash right into the hawk and kill it, leaving only feathers behind. If uh. Stewart, if Stewart, now listen here, jury. If Stuart is being held equivalent to human children when being adopted, why is he not held to the same standard in the court of humans? Huh? Answer that for me. Why it should he get away with such crimes? Mm, why? It, it was self-defense. He tried to kill his family. No and it's more a questions, falcon. your honor. Yeah, what? Yeah, what? <laughs> no further questions, your honor. Our last reason, Stuart is very punchable. Mm, that one's true. In conclusion, <laughs> in conclusion, I hate Stuart Little and so should you. He is a menace and an Avengers level threat, meaning the Avengers could and would destroy him and I wait with bated breath for them to do so. Thank you for your time, oh Stuart. Gosh. I hope you choke. No, no. Wait, I... hold, on. hold on. Charlie says that he was a... Queen comma he... Rin. <laughs> he was, he was a... a what? He had to think about it. He had to plan the murder. So not he only had to is it plan murder, he did it's, it's, yeah, it's premeditated. Oh, <laughs> he did it because if, if he was so high and mighty and he is, is held to the standard of humans, he could have gone to law enforcement and asked them to take care of the hawk. But he took it to his own hands because he is First crazy. Of all, that is premeditated vehicular manslaughter. That's I'd like to, premeditated I'd, vehicular falcon slaughter is, I think, the I'd also technical like term to, he I agree. Committed. I'd also like to really quick point out that I think it's very telling that um, Charlie openly welcomed and addressed rebuttals during your presentation mm. while Rin seemed to try to escape them. I feel like this Ooh. is Thank very you. telling. I am not escaping rebuttals, but I know that I'm right. 
There are no rebuttals. I Rush know that I'm right, you, but Matthew. You. Thank you, Matthew. I, hey, hey. I know I'm right, but I hey, welcome the opportunity the to prove it. Let's precisely. I, I know how we can end this. There's three of us that haven't presented. Let's vote. Who would win in a fight? Matt, I don't, okay. Who do you think? In a fight? See. Obviously. You are such a great person. Obviously. <laughs> don't Remy Charlie, Charlie shut it. <laughs> Remy grew up on the streets. Agree. And it's four times the size. Agree. Remy would win. Dude, Remy Agree. is a coward. He doesn't even handle I his think. own fights. He, um, he went into an old woman vote. with a okay. gun's house it's and tried vote. to get food. That is the it's most badass thing you could ever do. Therm Stuart I, committed I murder. I have what? one point to make before I move on from my, my statement, which is, you know how much strength it would take for a small rat to maneuver an entire human by tugging on their hair? That's that is very some true, strength. Or, and not, not only is and, it a burst of strength, a weak it is human. Stewart committed stamina. murder, but with help of a vehicle. Okay, but Remy, Remy can, can use anything. anything. Linguini's a vehicle. Knife. Yeah, actually. Therm, who is your Remy, vote for? But, but you can't my bring vote, a knife. My vote is, is uh, I found Charlie's presentation very captivating, so my vote is absolutely, unequivocally for Stewart. Oh, no. So much. Trash. So absolute much. trash. I'm sorry. I'm the tiebreaker. I oh, hate Stuart. you. See, you are such a kind of Let me think. It's your call. Is it's your call. That's what I will say. It's your call. See, you have good opinions, and I love your opinions. I love that about you. No, no, bro. No, i human. <laughs> Charlie, I, I respect you so much, Charlie, but Stuart I hate your Littles, opinions. Uh... Charlie, I appreciate your kind words, but I choose Ren. That is so bad. What? That's so oh. hey, unfortunate. Hey, hey, Let's go. Gone. I am going to write an essay. You. I am a, I am going to write an write essay on <laughs> why you are all wrong. Yeah, all right, Charlie, my PowerPoint. It's time for my PowerPoint. Right. Yay. It's okay. I know. I know. Anyway, um, Thank you, I would Therm. just like Thank to say nothing personal against you, Charlie, at all. Love oh, you. But I hate, no. I, I really do hate your opinion on that, but it's okay. <laughs> I, still, I still respect you. Ditto. Respect an essay. Wow, okay, so you. not the same energy back for me? Okay, no. you know what? It's fine. I'm used to people hating me. It's okay. Uh, I'm joking. I'm sorry. How do I but switch it to the I'll send Remy after Stuart right now. Uh, I'm not we sure. Stuart better. We hate Stuart better. No more Stuart better. We hate Stuart better. <laughs> Put that on the clubs, honestly. <laughs> on the clubs? That was the hardest thing to listen to I've ever heard. Yeah, that hurt a lot. <laughs> You're about to convince I, me to be on the other side. I've how never I... sweated more in my entire life. Therm, I respect you so much. Bro, how do I switch presenter view? I'm a fool. I have presenter view on my on the other monitor. Screen. Is anyone using actual PowerPoint and can help me figure out how to switch presenter mode? Oh, oh. no. I just I'm clicked. Google Slides, kind of, yeah. Google Slides. Oh my god, you guys are uh, bougie. Up top. Dude. Wait, go back in. Up top. Oh, middle. welcome to the future old Swamp. man. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay. And I want to see my chat go. while I do this. Okay, here we go. And I got to share. I'm going to scream if it pops up and you immediately come out <laughs> the gates with Ratatouille. There, are, there should be no time zones. <laughs> no. Come on, dude. <laughs> no, no, no. That ship has sailed. I have made my point there. <laughs> All right, can you guys see? Uh, I can see. Well, oh, maybe I'm, not. Here, I'll, I'll just share, I'll share no. my whole screen. I'm sorry. I see some wacky lines. It's okay. I have no sound effects. I'll just share the whole sure. screen. I got you. All right. My presentation is very short and it is controversial, but in a totally different way. All right. These are the five words that I am the only person that pronounces correctly. It's not everyone else's right. This is just me. Okay. Mm -hmm. So every, every slide follows the same format. And so we're going to go in order of least controversial to most controversial. Okay. So here's a little warm me up so that you guys understand what's happening and so that you guys can sort of ease into understanding that you've been doing this wrong for a lot of your lives, all right? So first up is the word cabinet. And so you can see each slide is broken up. The English spelling, this is the like weird dictionary notation. I had M's help right. with this. This is the only way we knew how to do this because there's weird letters. So M hand drew it I all am. and then texted it to me. And then mm -hmm. I screenshotted it. And then here I is like yay. my phonetic spelling of it, like sounding it out. So a lot of people- see more handwriting. Sure, sure, cabinet. sure. So cabinet. I think that's right. So that's right. A, well, a lot of people say cabinet, right? They really pronounce that I in the middle, but cabinet. Pretentious. You notice that I, I have think... dropped the I, cabinet. Not cabinet. That's cabinet. That's cabinet. That's how you say that right there. Please don't joke. Cabinet. 
Please don't joke during yeah. this, Charlie. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Yeah, this I'm really is a serious sorry issue. That. Well, you did, you betrayed me, so. Not, yeah, you can I'm suck not, it. Shouldn't you me. be watching Stuart Little? <laughs> yeah, go watch it. Everyone, I feel like we're losing focus here. All right, so first, yeah. I, I want to take a poll at the end of each slide. Yes or no, do we agree with yes. Z? We'll go. Yes. Okay. Cabinet. Yes. Cabinet. All right, good. Not controversial. Cabinet. Yes. No, no cabinet. Yes. No, no cabinet people in the Maybe chat. occasionally, right. nah. but not like, sub, like it's subconscious, I think. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Let's move on. Uh -huh. This is an orange. <laughs> orange. Oh. I'll say it That's a third fine. time. Orange. 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 All right. Orange. 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 I do not orange. say orange, orange or orange or orange. any orange. other part of that. I don't think orange. anyone says orange. Okay. Is it orange? It's not orange. It is orange. 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 Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not offended. I'm not offended, but I don't agree. Yeah, I say orange. orange. One yeah, syllable. Orange. orange. Nah. Orange. Orange. Correct pronunciation. Orange. It's orange. Uh, <laughs> thank orange. you. Okay. Uh, again, a lot of the time, this is the weird part. Also, thank you for bringing that up. Is that a lot of the time, Miriam Webster has these wrong, and that's why this PowerPoint is so important because it's setting it uh, straight. You know. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Is, I respect yeah. that. All right. That is, that's word two of, of five. So again, yeah. just a total tally. It's like, and no one says it the same as me, but again, that's, that's okay. Yeah. Let's move on. Yeah, yeah. This one gets M. <laughs> so M says that I say the word P-U-L-L -L and P-O-O-L -L the same. And I do, it is pronounced pool. And M okay. gets mad at me and she says, you Wrong. say, Pool and pool the same way. And she says the same thing the twice. Sentence? She literally just go, like, yes, like, hey, let's play tug of war and pool on the rope. Or, hey, let's go jump in the pool. Pronounce the same. You M said it different. Yeah, you said it. No, Wait, you said a little bit different. Let's play bit. tug of war and pool on the rope. Or let's go swim in the pool. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, you, you, you really, no. you really See, here's, accentuated here's, it there. Here's the problem is that M has, like, she she has, like, very much, like, enunciated, like, pull. Pull when she tries to explain it to oh. me. Pull. Pull is wrong. Pull. Pull. It's the same pull? as like pull. Like pull? let's get a yeah, it's pull. Same as P-O-L-E. Yeah. Pull. Yeah. Pull. Yeah. pull is disgusting. Pull. P-O-L-L. Pull? Ew. Pull. I'm about to vomit in my mouth, dude. Pull. This is pull. ridiculous. Maybe you pull. should. Pull. Go pull. for it. Let's pull on this. Give me the right. HD surround sound. Pull. This one now, is a little bit offensive. I do have a friend that also pronounces P-O-L-E as pool as well. That is okay. hard. Okay. I say pole for that. That's pole. true. Pole yeah, and pool are different, but pool and pool are the same. Mm -mm. Everyone with okay. me? No. No. Mm -mm. No, not at all. They're very far away at a far Please distance listen. right now. Say them both. Wrong. Pole and pool. Pole, pool. Pole, pool. Do you guys actually pole, say pole? Pole, pole. 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 I pull on the rope. Pole. I pull the rope. I pulled my friend. See, are you insane? Did you actually just say, oh, do you actually say this word right? Yeah, like, were you in the minority? Did you grow up? Did you grow up in, like, a white isolation room? You're ridiculous. Let's move on. What happened to you? This is number four or five. Remember, this is ascending order of controversy, so we're only halfway through. Oh, my God. Oh, Lord. No! 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 Actually, we... Next slide. Next slide. This is not crayon. This is not crayon. Cram? This is not crayon. This is not crayon. Cranberry? It's so controversial. I agree with Z. Thank you! Thank you, Rin! I draw a crayon. What is wrong with you? I would like to color this picture with a crayon. this entire evening, but I'm going to go ahead and jump over to the other side for this one. It is crayon. Crayon. Yeah, crayon. 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 And what am I saying? Crayon. crayon. What is it? Crayon. crayon. You're saying what's written on the slide. Oh. You're saying Crayola. Crayola crayon. Crayola crayon. Crayola crayon. It's but why are you crayon. going to crayon? It's so ridiculous right now. Like, crayon. 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 Oh crayon. my god. The crayon. 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 So pretentious. Crayon. crayon. Oh, it, yeah, you're Wait, right. You're it is pretentious to say words right. You're you're on board with me? It is. Thank you. Crayon. I mean, I'm not no. with you on the pool pole, but I am what about with you on like, this one. 
Like cranberry. It's now a cranberry. crayon berry. <laughs> crayon berry. No, it's not a switch. No, it's not a flip. No, no, it doesn't actually, work like that. Actually, that should be to you. Why don't you say cranberries as crayon berry? Because it's spelled C R A N. That doesn't make sense, Rin. Right? <laughs> but crayon is spelled C R A Y O N. Rin, you're, you're hurting. You're hurting, Rin. No, it's tough, please. I take it back. I take it back. See, I think you don't want Rin's support here. Hey. I'm sorry that I was let down in the education system, okay? Yeah, it's this true. is my final slide. The most <laughs> controversial of all. Potentially. What? Rins? How many of you say that this is this is crazy? I lived on this earth for 21 years before no. I even knew people said this differently. I knew Rins? that I said listen, Rins? listen. I knew that people said crayon and I said crayon. I was aware of that. I was uh -huh. in my room our sophomore year at one point, and I said like Hey, Eric, my roommate, can you can you rinse off the dishes? He's like, what'd you just say? I was like, rinse. And he was like, what? No. I was like, rinse. Oh, no. And he was like, are you saying rinse? And I was like, rinse? What is rinse? What? I've never heard rinse before. He's like, yeah, it's rinse. And I'm like, you're trifling. So we go across the hall to the only two other people that are around. And we say, hey, how do you say that thing when you like wash off a dish? They both said rinse, and I said, I had yeah, an I don't epiphany. know why you're surprised. Let, listen, one. listen. For, I, for a moment, I was like, oh my god. I can't believe I've been saying this word wrong my whole life. Until I brought up that experience at dinner later that night with a larger sample size of people. Rinse, 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 <gasps> rinse, what? down the line. Wow. Down the line. It was so only no. my People. roommate from Virginia, <laughs> all right, which is where Therm is, you know? So, Yo. like, that's probably why you say rinse as well, right? Like, it was what? only right. my roommate from Virginia, but me from Pennsylvania and all the other people from Pennsylvania. Rinse, all right? Yeah, I, I I would stand to argue if the word was rinse, it would be R-I-N-C-E. It would be rinse. No. Can, can you rinse? spell? No. Ew, it would can not be rinse. Spell? It'd be rinse. Yeah, rinse would, would be R-Y-N-C-E. -E. I took phonetics what? and linguistics. Well, no, think about the, is it spice? Do you say spice or do you say spice? <laughs> what? It's, it would you be rinse. Right. That's you say, oh, that's spicy, dude. That's an I before C thing. That's a totally different thing. There's an N in there. What? It's, yeah, that's a different. little bit different. It's different. No, M, M had another example. Well, M is in the chat uh, right now. M, what was the other example you gave me when we were talking about this the other day? M had an example and it you, proved you my say point. Wines? Chat says mints. Mints. Lens? Mint? Yeah, yeah mints. That's true. Mints and wins. Yeah, and wins. exactly. Yeah, actually, I would work. That's true. No, actually, That's you're right. True. See, a C Yeah, I see, I see to you to on that To be fair, one. the English language is very confusing. So yeah. I don't really blame you here. here. Here's the end of the, here's Here's what we have to take away from this, right? These are the five cursed words that I... Have correct. I'm sorry. Again, again, it's not your fault for disagreeing with me. You've been taught wrong. All right. I just I want think, you to be right moving forward. I'm pretty sure sense? this is the definition of insanity, but yeah. I think I can <laughs> agree to let you live your life the way you want to, as long as you agree to let me. Oh, live go my for life it. No, yeah, live, live, yeah. Live the way you want, as long as you don't. Like we're <laughs> none of us are right. If, on if we're honest, none of us are right. English is made up anyway. It's just someone was like, let's make words, and they did. So I think we're okay to say what we want. Also, please don't say crayon around me, because it makes me uncomfortable. But live you your mean life. do say? Oh wait, crayon. okay, I got crayon. confused there. <laughs> All right, crayon. I don't use that in hey. sentence daily, so I think it's fine. I want to leave a message to the people watching right now. I hope that this entire night was informational. I hope it was helpful. I hope that it raised some questions within you that you may not have considered up until this point. And I, I just really hope you took away a lot from this. Everyone, let's all say goodbye at the same time. Okay. Three, two, one. Goodbye. I hate Stuart Goodbye. Little. I hate you have little. bad opinions. You have Stupid bad opinions. Dumb fool. Okay. Wow, two of us said goodbye and everyone else fought each other. Oh, <laughs> I yeah, said goodbye. For? <laughs> oh my god, guys, that was so much fun. A freaking love PowerPoint wow. night. That was great. Wow. Uh, that was... Charlie, you should go back and watch the Ratatouille PowerPoint that I posted. It was like well over a year old now at this point. Actually, two years. No, a little over a year. We did PowerPoint night for the first time, and it was, uh, I will. It was something else. I'll send you the link then, because I think you'd find it Hi. funny. I will I'm definitely exhausted, watch that. Dude. <sighs> yeah, I am really I, worn out. I have an essay to write, honestly. <laughs> Dang, whoa! <laughs> She's gonna be oh, on the the, the Ratatouille too. forums after this. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. I'm like, there's I, actually a Reddit 
a, like a Reddit subreddit called F Stuart Little. <laughs> <laughs> and it's all posts of people who hate Stuart Little. Well, Full I'm circle. not allowed on yeah, that right. website, so. Right, 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 right. Because right, right. you've showered that. ever. Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm not doing that. <laughs> oh, no, I need to check no, my yeah. email. I need to check Doof Boompin. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hold on. Have Hold fun on. with that, check guys. I'm going to head out. Doof Thank boom. you very much. Right. That was okay. a blast. See ya. Peace Goodbye. out. See ya. Oh, man, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me tonight. That was a whole blast. I hope you guys had fun with that. Thank you very much. What a night we had from the 11 letter Wordle to some starting TikToks to me explaining how you guys should be saying words properly. Um, and before we leave, I will answer the question, how do we say the word C-A-R-A-M-E-L? That right there is pronounced caramel. I'll see you guys on Thursday. <laughs>